Chat, if you had to be an animal, which animal would you like to be? And why is it a raccoon? Wolf, I'm basic. It's funny how a lot of people make meme answers, but I think the wolf is the cringiest answer. A penis fish. I think I couldn't be a fish. I would be too scared of the vast loneliness of ocean and sea. You know what I sometimes thought, f think? Thank you, Alex, by the way. Thank you, man. Imagine... Just, just a, you know, it doesn't have to be real, okay? It's just a little meme. Imagine there was a technology that will put your brain into an animal for just 60 seconds. For 60 seconds, you see, feel, breathe, whatever, like that animal. I think we would go crazy. I think we would go crazy. I think that experience would be so massively insane, you would just go crazy in, 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 in a minute. Imagine you were in the body of a blue back blue whale blue whale for 60 seconds like you feel everything he feels you, you see everything he sees i think it will blow your mind man you know what, is that weird like imagine being an ant yeah is that is that like we talk smoking we talk imagine you're an ant for 10 seconds that must be bro you are you're probably that's probably what happened to joe rogue when he takes dmt that shit is gonna blow your mind so much you will never be the same again Being a jellyfish. <laughs> Jamie, pull that up. <clears throat> the milk is very hot. Okay, one second. Don't forget, guys, tomorrow. Tomorrow, the Vikings and Perry. P Perry? The White Kings in Paris Trucker Cap will be available tomorrow on White Kings Paris. Now, 250 pieces coming. The first order is coming with a signed autograph card. Look at that product. Look at that, huh? Tomorrow, coming out for you. Check it out. Ah, okay, before we start, with Turkey, Turkey, Turkey. Coming down. Would you rather be French or British? British. Whoa. Why not French, Tommy? What happened there? Watch your viewership skyrocket because of Turkey Amanakoya. Okay, let me take one sip of milk and then we can go in. I would like to listen to some synthwave. Sounds like the intro for a rap song, man. Oh wait, that's Pain and Uru talking? I know that voice. I think this is him talking to Pain about his friends. That drop is taking a while. Anyway, I didn't take my sip of milk yet. Mm. Oh man, I'm in love with milk, dude. God damn it. I need the song. Uh, it's I, I just clicked on this randomly. Seishin Asian lo-fi hip-hop mix. No idea, man. I just clicked this. I always click random shit. Gentlemen, we are opening the stream of going for Stable Grove! Boom! 
Stable growth in Turkey. Turkey. Stagnation is over, boy. What did we do yesterday? Pretty much nothing. We're just getting into the focus tree, checking out the sub mod, and slowly learning the mod, man. Just really being calm, paying off a lot of debt. Paint fight should have been the end of the series. Let's not go there. Go for helicopter. Go for sub. And let's just see where we go today. This is obviously going to take a long time. I think we're playing 20 years here. I'm just going to hang out and take my time, get the focuses done. As the developer says right here, please rush the 2001 economic crisis to make the game not bucked. So we got to rush this. And then I let you, chat, choose the leadership of Turkey, man. You guys will choose. <clears throat> Do I actually have issues in, the, uh, in Kurdistan? I don't. I don't. No, I no, I don't. Kurdistan has no basic uprising. Vladimir, is that the nationalist? Okay, we have a nationalist Russia that sometimes needs to war with China. We'll see. If you could choose when in history or where you would live for ten weeks, where would you live? That's interesting. Live for ten weeks. I wanted to say the the Stone Age, so you can just fuck up all the boys and have a lot of sex, but I will probably die very quickly. From the food and shit. Um, so, thank you, Osman. How are you, doing, you know, I will How take... I'm obviously, How you little history notes to say well. Roman Empire and... Uh, blah, blah, blah. I will take the Golden Twenties in New York or something. Or, like, in Germany. The Golden Twenties. Before the world went to shit. Something like that. Also, I would like to... I always say that to Lisa. I would like to have one night in, in the 80s Miami. One big party in the 80s in Miami. In the middle of the 80s, man, sniffing cocaine off a hooker's asshole. Just listening to, you're out of touch, I'm out of time. It's kind of where I am, seeing myself. We can still do that today, it's not the same feeling, bruh. Come on. That's cringe, what's your answer, fucking Roman Empire? What's your answer, huh? That's cringe, you didn't even give an answer, watch him. doesn't even fucking answer he just fucking spams gachi hyper bullshit trash this fucking music man <laughs> Sasuke! Kake! Shidori! germany giving me the set the light dose oh, oh. <laughs> Okay, I just did an anti-corruption move against the DSP, Conservative Party. Now, I make changes in my constitution, getting less and less Western support. Okay, the new president of Turkey. Let's see where this goes. I really don't know. SEO makes large scale stuff. I'm getting more and more money. I'm paying off my debt. I want to be debt free, you know me, and I probably should get into some officer soon. Random question. Do you still watch UFC? I'm still a massive fan of UFC, man. Massive fan. I want to be in 1888 London during the Jack the Ripper murders. How will that be interesting to you? We'll probably never meet the guy. That is weird. Maybe you just want to be him? Because you're weird? That's a weird answer. I don't know. You know these people, man? Like these edgy hoi four people that are deep in the reddit hole that are like that will say i would like to be in world war ii so i could fight for my country like people like this are a little like that's people you stay away from that's people you don't touch terrorist attack i have a lot of terrorist attacks i don't even know what they do i don't understand really to be honest jack was based on mega low you, you are 100 under 18 years old man Let's see where the game goes. I, mean, I really like this. And I want this to be a long ride. I still have four hours on stream. Let's really take our time here and just see what happens, man. To find him, dude. Fuck cares. Thanks to Lamino, you kind of know what times the murder happens. You should dye your red hair redder than it is already. What kind of comment is that? Like, what? Pause. What? What, what is wrong with people? You should dye your hair better than it is. Why are you playing as something we eat? Would you rather be American or American? You should dye your... Okay, we have a complete retard. We have a... Retard alert! Retard alert! We have a retard alert! Execute order! Retard! Uh, boop! Oh! 
the judgmental council of retardation has ruled you retarded thank you real and may you now go into the annals of retardation man i see over oh, the with a lot of operations <clears throat> I have a lot of uh, events here for Turkey. I just don't know what to do yet. I first want to see what you, the chat, choose as my political agenda. And then from there, we're going to go. This music is getting a little bit. How about this music? That's the music we need, man. It was a sub, though. This is what I think about that, huh? I touched my balls. You think it's just because you give him money, you can do what you want? I'm not an oligarch. Raid to terrorists so that decrease terrorist attacks. Raid your own terrorists. What is you talking about? Dude, there's so much stuff I can do about Islam and shit. It's gonna be deep. Uh, do something about counter-terrorist operations. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, I should probably do this. Decisions related to anti-terrorism action. Finding new defensive countermeasures may decrease the max strength of the PKK. Whoa. I have a normal preparation. I use a sif. Unlocks the attack decision. External operation against the PKK. I'm doing operations against the PKK. PKK, sorry, I always. But there's another PKK, man. Like, how much? There's so much shit, man. Fuck Somalia. I can't really work on this. So much going on. Kurdish language pro problem. This is a good thing I should do this. For years there was an unwritten rule against Kurdish language. Not only opening television channels and universities with Kurdish language is banned. Even if you are telling something in Kurdish in public or in the street, you might get attacked verbally. And nearly 20% of our population has Kurdish as their mother language. We need to solve this. Start reforming... The decisions about the Kurdish... That's it. I should actually do all these decisions, man. I I should pay more attention, man. Damn. Canada instantly revokes their satellite rights when I try to be a bit more pro-Kurdish. Come on, Canadians. This is helping my, my Kurdish stuff. Okay, more and more terrorist attacks. Oh, I'm working on it now. We're working on the terrorist attacks. I have to make the threat of the PKK go down. Very interesting, man. Very, very sick. After this, I get Ahmed Nekudet Cesar as the president of Turkey. Thank you, Zeus, for the 14 months. Appreciato molto. Tommy, the devil of reason is from the French Revolution. I don't know if you knew this. Interesting. Wow. Cool. Let's get a new president. What do you think about that? Okay. Anti-terrorism and Kurdish language problems. How is it possible I play a game like this and there's people actually, like, literally, seriously debating the PKK Kurds right now? You know, this is Twitch, and all your opinions don't really mean shit here. Anti-PKK anti propaganda. I wonder, is that gone forever then? Or, I wonder. Or is this a one-time thing? Central bank rises interest rate to 11.25. yay. yay. The Turkish people grow more social liberal, remove liberal society, and end extremely liberal. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Okay. So I don't I'm not gonna do politics yet until you guys chose what you want from the country. Silvi Berlusconi in Italia. 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 The submod is called. I have no idea. I have no idea. If you expel Kurdish to Europe, there will be no more kebab restaurants. Terrorists. Oh. Witnesses report terrorists use an IED. What is that IED? To blow up a road. Repair the damage. For five days, I repair. Sure. Thank you, Flippin' Le Jeff, for the five. Thank you. Are you French because of the love? Merci. Merci. Merci pour uh, les siens subscriptionnés, mon frère, c'est très bon. Wow, 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 wow. 
Oh là là. Ta mère, grand cul, très joli. Oh là là. Improvised explosive device. Oh. Or I eat these nuts. I have a lot of terrorism. I gotta really look into these events, man. Well, I'm doing anti peer kaka -ka -ka and the discrimination of Kurds. The Kurdish language gets more free. I get stability. Okay, I'm ending Kurdish discrimination, man. This is really fun, man. GRPS is coming in. I'm already gonna uh, spread my 2G network. I actually have some 2G already. Yeah, but I have no SIFs building anything. Microprocessors. I, don't, I wish I had an economy. Okay, and microcomputers. And I'm still doing... Remind the world that the PKK is communist. Looks like these are all one-time things. Interesting. It's kind of like a storyline you have to go through. Take Greece a bit early for that. Calm down. Okay, brief. Ah, that's a basic thing, yeah. They are... They want to reform their democracy or something. Another terrorist attack. Ay, ay, ay. Did I make the terrorist attacks go... I didn't even make it go down, man. I need a lot of political power for this stuff, and I actually need my political nah, power for more I important am stuff. Australian. You're Australian? Oh, thank you for the 500. Well then, um... The legendary old joke. Thank you very much, brother. Thank you. Thank you for the, the bits and the subs, bro. George Bush actually wins for once. George Bush actually winning for once. That, that never happens often. Yeah, he's Austrian. Yes. Good joke, huh? I actually never had George Bush yet in this new version of the game. DNA fingerprinting into modern GMO. I actually need my political power for other stuff. I can't just waste 200 right now to fuck with the PKK. But dude, their terrorism is massive. But it's like a storyline. It's actually really cool. Actually, you get research, man. Non-sympathetic college professors. That actually gives me 5% research. And 7 stability. I'm kind of fixing the country right now. By making the Kurds more integrated. Kurdish schools and universities. Also giving me bonuses. This actually kind of makes sense, right? But this is bad fun, man. How there's so much deep stuff going on. Uh, small increase on salary. Oh, God. Or acts in prison. Small increase on salary. Whose salary? And all of Turks? Okay, Turkish people get a better salary. But trying to change my name for years now. Why isn't it working? It's pretty easy to change your name on Twitch, isn't it? I think. I need more resource slots, man. But the, the developer says I need to rush the focus here. But once I took this focus, you're gonna see me be AFK industry. I'm gonna be AFK industry build up. Thank you, Meter... Meter... Meteric or Meteric? Thank you, man. Thank you, man. Salaries of state workers. Here's my opinion on the Kurdish movement, Tommy. Investment offer from China? I, I need industry. I'm not saying no to that. I ain't saying no. Okay, it's Kurdish schools and universities. We will allow Kurdish language to be used alongside Turkish in specific schools and cities. This this really helps the country a lot, so why not? Germany revoking. Everybody is mad that I helped the Kurds. Whoa, man. Whoa, man. I could also still work... Cross-border operation. I can attack the PKK. Okay, I'm attacking the PKK. PK, I always say PKK, man, because it's in German, sorry. Uh, economic withdrawal. Add 250 million to the treasury. For 10 stability? I'm against it. 75 PP. Use force to stop officer riots. Okay, I'm, I'm stopping officer riots. You're saying it like Turks. They also say PKK? In Germany, we say PKK. PKK. I'm trying to attack the PKK. You want to hear a really boomer thing? When I zoom in the game, it hurts my eyes. If it's like the FPS are weird or something. Yeah, it's actually 23 FPS, which is weird. It actually hurts my eyes to zoom in the game. It's kind of weird. 
Like, gives me a headache. Oh, God. Lebanon voted non aligned. They are offering access to satellites? Sure. Ghazan Amnesty. Uh, the law of conditional release and postponement. Originally called the law of conditional release and postponement. <laughs> Good job. It was adopted on December 22, 2000 as a suggestion of Razan Eshebit. <coughs> Introducing a postponement or conditional release for crimes other than crimes committed against the state. On December 19, 2000, three days after Operation Return to Life, which has launched to end the death fast actions, the Conditional Release and Postponement Act, number 4616, was passed. After the am am amnesty law, which was issued because there was no room left in prisons. What? The population of prisons, which had a capacity of 7,000 people, had fallen to 40,000. <clears throat> Thank you, Flippy. Oh, I'm choking a bit. Thank you, man. Change the national focus tree to Mafia Underground HQ. Wait, you can, you can play the Mafia? Change the focus tree to the Mafia focus tree. <clears throat> the Mafias begin to prepare to take over the country. Uh, so this is how Aragon takes over, okay. You can't let the Mafia take over? I, I don't know. Sounds rather silly, man. It's funny for like five minutes. Thank you, Back Porch Light. The scope is sufficient to present. Legacy of the 28th of February. Military Memorandum in Turkey refers to decision issued by the Turkish military leadership on a National Security Council meeting on 28 February 1997, this memorandum initiated the process that precipitated the resignation of Islamist Prime Minister Nekmetin Erbakan of the Welfare Party at the end of his coalition government. As the government was forced out without dissolving the parliament or suspending the constitution, the event has been famously enabled as the postmodern coup. Turkey is a coup country. The liberals want more support. 15% nah. I'd rather have 75 pp and a terrorist attack. Noise, 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 brother. Okay, I'm kind of looking to farm political power, man. It's gonna really take years to fix this country, man. You gotta do a Turkish Tony Soprano playthrough, man. <laughs> she woke up this morning. I got myself a kebab. I got myself a kebab. I got myself pejiktas. Mm -hmm. Well, my debt is going down and my income is growing. A turkey with a steady income. Can you imagine? Let's involve Kurdish TV channels. Collapsing house prices. Can you fuck off? I'm getting back into stagnation. No, I'm making Kurdish TV channels, which gives me more PP, and I just got back to stagnation. Ugh, I paid so much for that. Uh, okay, it's gonna literally take years to fix this country. But I like that. I like that in this game, that you actually have to focus on fixing your country first. I really like this shit. Did I make the PKK weaker? I made an operation, didn't mean to do shit, man. Good preparations for an external... Okay, I'm doing operations against the PKK? That's the mod, yeah, I like that though. You have to build up for many, many years. I, I am into that, you know me. Obviously, nothing's gonna happen, like war-wise, but pff, who cares? Don't waste your PP for economy until 2003. What? In Sweden, the police thought that the PKK killed our prime minister. It really wasn't, so the real killer wasn't caught. Build up until 2022. Entering 2001. After this, I do prison acts and then release some people from prisons. To 2001. Whoa, oh my god. Nice. Oh, fuck me, dude. Welcome what is this, Kaiserreich? Thank you, Echo Man. On February 2001, Prime Minister Eschewitt emerged from a meeting with President Zizar saying this is a serious crisis. Or, or as you say, this is serious crisis. In this underscored financial and political instability and led to further panic in the markets. The stocks plummeted and the interest rate reached. 3,000%? 3%. Large quantities of Turkish lira were exchanged for US dollars or euro, causing the Turkish central bank to lose 5 billion of its reserves. What is this, Erdogan? The crash triggered even more economic turmoil in the first 8 months of 2001. 15,000 jobs were lost. The dollar rose to 1.5 million liras and income inequality had risen. Oh, <laughs> the 2001 Turkish economic crisis. The country is completely destroyed. 
Yeah, the country is... Yeah, we're fucking dead. Yeah, I... Oh, fuck me, dude. Okay, man. Haha, <laughs> fun. I need to get back to recession with 180, man. This feels way too real, man. This turkey is very weak right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I actually lose money. I'm gonna go downhill. I need to uh, go into recession, man, with 180. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. First time. <sighs> Trucks on Chattel Ukraine? Why? This is the real country. Under elections. They actually had 3,000% interest rate. Act in prison. I'm releasing 2,000 prisoners. Apparently, Turkey has too many prisoners or some shit. Okay, back to recession. Fixing this monkey country. Jesus, come on. Kemal Derivis took office. He took Minister of Economic Affairs. Ululum. Terrorist attack. Ululum. And I got my first construction research. This country will be all right on track in just 20 years. Do not be worried. Next upgrade is um, Georgia Joint C SCO. I need 240 for stagnation. After this, I release some people from prison. Forgive some guilty people. I don't have time for this. Entering 2001, and then we do the election, and then I can start doing industry, man. I, I feel dirty not doing industry. You know me, boys. I just want to do industry. Industry, 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 I have zero sifts, man. Curtis State Channels. More bonuses. I'm making the Kurds like me, man. Good preparation for an, an internal move. Turkish inflation is 54% as of February 2022. When you want strong leader, you want strong inflation. Add some prison, release some people from prison. Pick Bezim Tibuk, how about you subscribe and then you put halloumi in your mouth and shut the fuck up. Um, just don't let the 15th of July happen and Turkey will be fine. What? what? Oh no, oh no, oh no, no. I'm actually making money again. Okay. Ah, because I got rid of the depression. Ay, 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 that crisis really hurts. Wait, Kurdish TV channels are permitted. I thought that gives me positive stuff. I'm confused. Is it for a while, or...? Ah, they become official and it gives me a bonus. Okay, I'm actually fixing the country here a bit with the Kurds. Okay. It gets rid of the negatives. Yeah, yeah, air disaster. 16 May, a Kasa type military cargo plane produced by Thai crashed near Arkadaj, Malatya. 34 soldiers have died. 10 of them are Turks. Where are the, who are the other soldiers? Protests against the government. Ouch. That's a lot of PP down the drain. Ay, ay, ay. Schroeder won the election in Germany. GRPS Internet. I don't really need to research 3G because I can't. I can't work. I, I can't build it anyway. I'm too broke. In my game, the pickup corporations didn't do shit. They're kind of buggy. Same with me. They don't do anything. Maybe I should stop clicking this. Oh, what if it's actually bugged? That's kind of sad. That's already the, the first little demotivational message in this mod. Looks like the PKK stuff does not work at all. Seems bugged, I guess. Hmm. It's bugged, I think. That means I have to play the whole game with um, terrorism. You need to strengthen outpost first. Well, do you need three for that? The civilian one worked though. No. It's still 100 damage everywhere. That's that's fake news. Huh. Can't really do much about that Kurdish terrorism. Mm -hmm. If I have a missile, I can do an air raid against the Kurds. 
DIP turn to DP. They changed the name. I just, I'm gonna have terror stacks the whole time. Shell of the Soviet past. For some time, our Coast Guards have monitored a massive rusty carrier hull towered, towed around the Black Sea. It's a rare sight to be sure. Did that actually happen in real life? Dude, look at that picture. The ship named Varyak is decorated with Soviet golden stars and towed slowly by some mix of small tugboats. Originally from Ukraine, its final destination is Chinese leisure company in Macau. The hull can pose a real threat to traffic. Hmm, that's really f interesting. Yeah, China, pay me. China's paying me. Hey, China's paying me. That's how you make business. You pay me for that shit. Boss force belongs to me, boy. Thank you, China. Easy money. Beijing accepts. Good man, good man, good man. Good man, give me that money. Entering 2001. 100 pp. Yeah, these operations don't do anything, man. Actually, though, mm -hmm. unlocks the attack decision when completed. I mean, I don't think this is bug because this one actually says the pickup power goes down down by ten. That sounds almost like it makes sense. I guess I have to stop all that pickup stuff for a while. I don't understand it. We will see. That became the first Chinese aircraft carrier, Liao Ning. Interesting. In my game, the PKK never got below 60. At least in your game, they moved. So that shows that means they actually moved down. Okay. Did you play Chan already? No. No, 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 no. I did not do no, no, no. Outposts and airstrikes are important, others not. Okay. So I have to wait a bit until I have economy. Okay. Constitutional court shuts down the Fazile party. The Vajak has finally passed through the Bosporus today. That looks insane, man. Wow. Damn. 5 pp. Interesting. <clears throat> Don't go AKP, please. I literally said 20 million times. You guys choose, man. You dumb monkeys. Have you seen Grisha's video? I have not and never will. I don't give two shits, man. Why do you give such a shit? Tommy, are you gonna try USA in this mod? Uh, if they have a sub mod, yes. Mission to North Cyprus. There's so much going on, man. Everybody's investing a Thai, man. They're all building their stuff here. No one else. Okay, this is how I also fixed the economic crisis. Let's go. Let's go. Entering 2001, internationalized Sabiha Gokchen, whatever the hell that means. I'm getting a massive airbase in Eastern Trakia for 5 billion. Okay. Uh, okay, sure. It's an airport. I'm building an airport here. Interesting. Which path are you choosing? Are you fucking retarded, Alter? Stabilize sec. Tarion woes in decisions for weak stability. Oh! Oh, you get weak stability from that? Oh! Oh, I should probably do that. Population of the Kurds, of the Islamists, and the Kemalists. Oh, unite the people. There's so much going on in this mod, man. It's like so much, I'm not even gonna look into it too deep. Too crazy down the rabbit hole. I just want to really get into the... Uh, I want to get into the Sif tree, man. I want some sweet-ass economy. I heard Tommy say Altor, Altor or something. Like, what does that mean? Exclamation mark Altor in the chat, please. Sorry, I just connected. Well, still, are you retarded? Then connect earlier. What are you doing? You should watch the stream when it comes online. Stop having a job and a life. What's wrong with you? It's 2022. We're all going to die anyway. <coughs> Is it possibly come a camelus from Dawn? Yes. I mean, you just, you just saw it. I literally just showed it. Assassination of Ahmed Shah Masood. Okay, we're gonna go to stagnation, which is kind of the best economy Turkey can have lately. 
<laughs> AKP closure case. The AKP has been created. Right wing Islamist Fazile party. Fazile party founders created a different party called AKP. The right wing Islamist. This party is moderate Islamist and this party originally worked with the Islamic Gulen movement. I will have infinite terrorist attacks, man. AKP! Okay, the AKP has been formed. Ban them instantly. AKP! Justice and Development Party. Justice. Justice. There are parliamentary duties and decisions for the economic boom. Uh, sure, bro. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I totally know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Osman Pugulilu's opinion. Wait, what, Alter? Osman Pamugulu is a commander currently serving the Turkish armed forces. The events taking place in Turkish politics may cause this commander to enter into political affairs. That's why this commander's thoughts on politics are very important. If Osman's opinion on the Turkish politics increases around 250% negative points, he would likely join the politics of stand being commander. If the Osman Pugululululu opinion on the Turkish politics stay around 25%, he will stay a commander. His current opinion is 25. Okay. Declare war on the Mafia. I could go to war with the Turkish Mafia. Fuck it, I'm declaring war on the Mafia, baby. I'm going to war with the Mafia. And I'm buying sifts, man. Look at all these investments, dude. Look at all these investments. There's so much you can do in this mod. It's mental. Thank you, Delikan. Merci. AKP is Erdogan, by the way. Wow, crazy. Italy having 20 elections every day again. And I internationalized Sabiha Gurchen. Gurchen. Airport. That's the airport we're gonna bomb. Greece. Uh, that's the airport we're gonna visit Greece from. Man. Fucking with the mafia, guys. Oh. oh no! Oh no! Okay, this fixed my economic crisis a bit. Western powers get very weak, and I get uh, some of my debuffs weakened. The Turkish economic crisis is getting weakened a little bit. Okie dokie pokey. Interesterando. Modern GMOs, let's get gene therapy. Population is very, very important in this game. Somebody having a stroke? Why is he pronouncing all those Turkish words so weird? Glücksrat in Turkey, I want to buy an U. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Great joke. Traumatic scenes as regime changes in Ukraine. Nationalist. Ooh. After a period with uptick in foreign intelligence activity, especially from Russia, the previous government of Ukraine has been toppled. Oh, the nationalist leader of Russia is massively fucking with Ukraine and, made, and, and aligned him to himself now. That's actually very realistic for a nationalist uh, Russia, man. Uh, Multi-walled carbon nanotubes. Just getting industry going in Turkey. Turkey. And after this, we have an election, boys. I actually can take most of these. Ah, once I have economic sickness, I choose. And then we have a big vote, guys. Then we're gonna have to pause the stream for a second. I'm gonna read every one of them to you guys, and then you guys can choose. I have two sifts building, can you believe it? It's foreign investments, though. You can take AKP or DSP. I probably also can take a lot more, you monkey. Siege people be boring, guys. It's just EU and stuff. Make a poll. What do you think I'm gonna do? That's that was a loss, man! The more time goes by the day, the more retarded chat gets! 20 times in the last 40 minutes I say I'm gonna let chat choose. And this fucker! Andrew96, is this your IQ, bro? Says make a poll. Bro! Can we please raise IQ back to at least 80 in the chat? I play Elden Ring, chat is cool. I play Hoi 4, <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. What do you think I'm gonna do? Count with my fingers or what? 
Thank you for two years, Teju. 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 Thank you, man. Come on, chat. In a world like this, you can't be this stupid. We actually can. I mean, look at TikTok. Anyway. Uh, hey, Tommy, will you let us choose? Uh, have you seen Man the High Castle, Tommy? Okay. Oh, letting you choose, that's gonna be fun, huh? Winter tourism attractions. And then there's a guy in a fucking war world, man. You come to Turkey winter, you can shoot, you know? EU-Turkey deal. Isn't that the... the Stopping the flow of migration, yeah. Okay, how does it help me, though? The deal with the Europeans. I have war with the Turkish Mafia, man. Which gives me nationalism. Huh? Wait, emerging means Mafia. Like Vladimir Putin. Voting for search of economic problems. There will be a vote for new proposals. On what? I don't understand. Independent Turkey Party has been created. Independent Turkey Party. And the more terrorist attack. Increased police levels. Ah, this makes my war with the Mafia better. I'm making the uh, police stronger. Create an anti-Mafia investigation bureau. It's pretty cool, man. Okay, I'm really fucking with the Mafia here a bit. Oh, thank you, Seeker, my brother. Appreciate it. Thank you, man. Play an MP game with this mod. And we have a first ban. It, dude, I'm literally sp speaking about retardation. And then you do this. You do this. So, mate, what, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? In society, you put crazy people that are a bit weird, you put them into certain institutions, right? To, to help them out a bit, you know, to not let them run them out in public. You think I can let you run around and chat like this? I, I, I gotta do it. You force me. Can raid terrorist hideouts and shit, man. Fun de-radicalization programs. I don't know what to do with all this stuff, man. It's too deep. Limit female employment. What the fuck, man? So much weird shit happening here. It's almost like too much going on. So, election time. Coming, coming, coming. This is a case of too much choice, yes. Uh, developers in Hoi 4, mod developers, they always go too far. They always overcomplicate things. Take the economic problems decision for fast growth. Take the economic problems decision for fast growth. Take the economic problems decision for fast growth. If I don't find it, you know you're banned, right? You know that. Okay, take the economic... Take the economic... Do an airstrike... It's all at the top. He's talking about this here. Okay, he actually didn't lie. I think this might actually give me power. Investigation revealed that the terrorists have attacked a factory belonging to a local businessman. Hit their retreat. Focus on repairing. Hmm. Help him rebuild his business and find jobs for his employees. This gives this ends up giving me more stability, man. Okay, I cannot take for some fucking reasons. Okay, I don't even know if I have to do this. The developer says you have to take 2001 economic crisis. And now the game is unbucked. I could actually go into industry now. I actually can't. I need to finish reforms of the state. Uh, oh, I need to go all the way. Well then, it is time. It is time. It's actually, it's four. I can make a poll out of this. Okay, here we go, chat. The people of Turkey vote. Unlike in real life. What? What? We have, first of all, the government isn't done yet. I get the DSP focus tree. Uh, DSP. This is DSP, whatever. DSP is the conservative pro-EU party. Military plot. Changes national focus tree to third military junta. The, f the National Unity Committee overthrows the government. AKP would likely to take over country if the army withdraws from the politics. Unless the National Unity Committee doesn't withdraw. Then we have military junta. Could lead to AKP. We have AKP. Erdogan party. Or we have Erdogan movement. Which is... I have no idea. 
The Sadet Party. Mili Gurus will again come to. Who is that? The Sadet Party. Let me read about them. Sadet Party. Who the fuck is that? Sadet Party. Sadet Party. Sub to help party. Tommy restore faith in chat. They are emerging. The virtual party was banned from the constitutional. While the party reformist wing formed the Justice Development Party AKP, the hardliners founded the Felicity Party. Uh, they're like hardcore Islam. Okay, guys, this is the four options. This still doesn't determine the full game, but okay, you choose. I took the government is not done yet and I bucked the focus tree. Uh, okay. What happened to the Japan game? I wonder what happened to it, you monkey. Use your head. Military Junta instantly wins. Okay. The military takes over the country. Mi uh, you Turks love that shit, right? You're kind of used to that. It's your culture. Military plots. The National Unity Committee overthrows the government. The military takes over Turkey. Here, National Unity Committee. The modern history of the army began with its formation after the collapse of the Ottoman Empire. The Turkish military perceived itself as the guardians of Kemalism. Ah, uh, this is kind of Ataturkish way. We're kind of playing Ataturkish. Okay, I need to go all the way to this and then I can start playing the game for real. This will be a very long game, I'm telling you, man. I need to do this to get my economy back on track. Military unit have 60%. Pretty big, man. Terrorist attack. Bayraktar, Bayraktar, Kulia, Kulia, Amanakoyim. Bayraktar, Bayraktar, Merheba, Bayraktar. Did you win the Japan game or give up or what? Well, check the bot, you bitch. You don't go to the fucking cinema, man. Hey, cinema staff, what happened in that fucking Avengers movie? Can you tell me? Check it out yourself. Don't annoy the fucking poor cinema staff. Wait, where did that... Wait, and now left. The decision... Wait, the decision is gone now. Hey! Arrest the mafia. Oh. Oh, I just... I just destroyed the mafia in Turkey, man. Wait. Wait, what... Yo, why, why? I, oh, I have too much stability. Oh. Oh, I have too much stability, Chad. Uh, uh, just cheat real quick. I could actually just reload, maybe. 1st of January, 2002. Yeah, 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 we can do that. It's, oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Tommy saved Turkey. Okay, don't take the mafia thing. Go DSP Alto. Why would I do the most boring party? Campus Dono Reco, you boring bitch. Bayraktar, Bayraktar. I should not beat the mafia. The military is gonna take over and then we kill the mafia. Why is this helping the AKP? Because it's realistically. Failed assassination of Harimi Ayapalim Bombi. Ben Carty, thank you very much for the seven months. On the nose, baby. On the nose. Okay. You accidentally saved Turkey. The military. The tree will change. Ah, the tree will change regarding who takes over. You get the third military junta focus tree. Okay. I wonder what that looks like. Every party has their own focus tree. It's pretty insane. The Sedar Revolution in Lebanon. I'm interested. Non-aligned free patriotic movement. Yeah, I'm gonna meet you later. You know that. We're gonna meet. If you don't mind, could you take a look in the Czech Republic as a focus tree? Can you do it yourself, man? What the fuck? They don't. They don't. Okay? They don't. You go out there, make a sub mod for them. If you don't mind, I just read that. Fight against Erdogan, he is a menace. Can you just... My god. This is just a video game stream, and every Turk in chat thinks this is the opening for a political debate about what they think is right. Maybe that's the problem with you Turks, man. You care too much about dumb shit. Afyon Earthquake in Turkey. Oh no. Oh no. 
I had an earthquake and a terrorist attack. Lebanon is still emerging. Military junta take over. Bayraktar, the Bayraktar. I am gonna kill the mafia. Will click. I arrest the mafia. Oh shit, Aldo. Remove the president. Replace guardians of Kemalism with National Unity Committee of Kemalism. Remove the Nationalist Coalition partners. Oh wait, let me just click and see what happens. Turkish military coup. Too real, man. Too real. True story from back in the day. This is a story that only old school viewers know. It's not a lie. When the Turkish coup happened in real life, I was playing Turkey in multiplayer and I was cooped. The same day. The same, like, hours uh, hours uh, 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 away from each other. Swear to fucking God, man. Um, as the economy and corruption grew behind, the Turkish armed forces took over. About 223 people were arrested. In the attempted coup, two guards were killed. In Turkey, the army stated that it will leave the administration at any time and that they were extremely committed to the principles of Ataturk. And the new leader is Hussein Kiryu the leader of the military junta. And a new focus tree emerges. Okay, I lost my entire focus tree. Yo, man, there will be more. What the fuck? Dude, what? In the world? Let's just keep following, man. Dude, my entire focus tree is gone. It's such a bad focus tree, it probably turns into a new focus tree later, you monkey. Oh my god, chat, you guys are so fucking retarded, man. You guys are so massively dumb, it hurts. It obviously is gonna become bigger once you finish the election. If you use your head for one second. As a leader, I'm really, really concerned sometimes about your health. Some of you guys are so fucking dumb. At least I have early 3D printers now, huh? 3D wax printers. And 9-11 happens. Oy, 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 oy. Diplomatic? Oh my god. Jihadists kill multiple civilians. Oh shit. Fuck me, dude. Military statement. The first statement came after the coup was carried out. Military statement, messages that demand the attention of the Turkish Republic and insult Ataturk are received by politicians. These politicians will be arrested quickly. Those who brought the situation to our country can no longer come to the power of that country. Those who put our country in a situation have been banned from making unlimited policies. After the glorious Turkish army captured the country, it immediately began inspecting the administrative facilities and found a lot of corruption. This corruption is one of the biggest steps in making Turkey like this. Efforts to amend the constitution have been accepted after corruption has damaged our country and no... Uh, what? Has the power to control it. After it is prepared, it will be presented to the public with an election. And after the election, I get a new focus for you fucking idiots. Plus five stability. Terrorist attack? Do I stand with America? I'm condemning the attacks, but I make no promises. Makes sense. The third military junta. Connections with USA, Iraq mission, national state. This is gonna be weird, man. Open elections. They happen here. Oil agreements with the US. All this USA shit does not look that good. You get USA. The war on terror starts. The whole US tree is not interesting me. I'm not interested. Iraq mission. Join the US invasion. Enter Mosul. <laughs> Integrate Mosul. Wait, what? Wait, how would I enter Mosul? There's no opening in it. Yo, what do you mean? I can't reach that. What is... What? US 8 is decent. There's nothing here, you monkey. You actually get two mils. But you get emerging support. Um, How would I reach Iraq? Ne Control Ninef. I can't get in here. I don't understand. There's one small state connection. That is connected? Hmm. Even though, in my opinion, I sh I'd rather just play Isolationist for now. I think. I don't know if I like this. Intervening with people right now. We're way too early for that. 
I'm arresting the mafia. That's good. Switzerland joins the UN. So many terrorist attacks, man. I think Iraq is going to be in next in Kurdistan. We don't know that. National state plus free stability. These fuckers have elections all the time. Thank you for the $10 left. I watched your YouTube and stream for some time. I appreciate and enjoy your enthusiasm to the game and entertainment. Your commentating during the $4,000 tournament was great. I don't always have the money to support, but thank you for the content. Thank you for the support, man. Appreciate it, brother. Thank you very, very mucho. Mucho grande. I have so much technology that's not getting used because I have zero sifts. I hope once I did the elections, I get my, my, my civilian focus tree. But well, the developer said I can't do the um, civilian focus tree. I have to do this stuff. So let's just run through this. I'm becoming a mobilized guardians of Camelism. Which gives me massive Western support. Dude, these terrorist attacks are getting a bit boring. Probably not for the people that realize them. Thank you, Jabik. Jabik. Invade Iraq. Thank you for your amazing... Thank you. Pass the game. Pass the game. It's just so good to always have these amazing advisors here in the game. Haystining with Invade Iraq. Just a great statement. Really intelligent human being here. Uh, wow. Invade Iraq, Millennium Dawn, 3D printed chat, Atatruk Lol. Yeah, we see a very intelligent guy here. Tommy K, in Sweden, the police, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. I would be really confused if I woke up there, too. Free all Turks on Germany. Just randomly thinks like, I'm going to put Invade Iraq in the chat. <sighs> Okay, let's get the stagnation first. Change flag. Oh, I got a new flag. Weird. I feel like I can completely challenge our enemies. I can do border wars? And struggle Armenia. I'm not gonna touch this yet. I wanna I wanna be an isolationist in the beginning. I have dude, I have zero sifts. I'm not gonna invade anyone. But interesting stuff. Do it! Tell me do it! Tell me do it, man! I can't even talk to the girl like in class, but I I'm on Twitch all day telling streamers to just fucking do it, man. Uh... Let's get neural uh, network revival, five percent research speed. What the fuck did I just join? Don't act like this is weird, Nuka. Every day the stream is like this. Anyway, white ring armed camel estate. Ay, 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 ay. Actually, economic movement. So I have to go through this focus tree here for a while. It's going to take a while. Not much is going to happen, to be honest. Let's get stagnation. Do you know, is there any other country to change focus tree by changing ruling party? Uh, no idea, no idea. George Bush announces it during freedom, and Afghanistan is gone. US wants help with the Taliban. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Dude, why do you have so many events at once? Um, I will send soldiers to the fight. I'm gonna help. Thank you, Luca, for the 10 men. I want good relations with George Bush. Makes no sense to fuck with him when I go mad in, in, in the Middle East. Uh, thank you, Luca. Dude, I... I'm happy when you're here, okay? Because you actually have a brain. Thank you, man. The, the young party GP, Chem Uzan, made a speech. She says, Yes, I will find a job for the other blind. I will give a salary of 350 UAH until I find it. These of you will be one little OSS. The, nobody understands you, bro. Nobody knows what the fuck you're talking about. The Gen G party gets 3%. AKP has rallies. We have the rise of moderate Islamism in Turkey. AKP has met. If you are against the country, I'll put you to prison without a proper court case. Woo! I will make my daughter's son a minister 
and I will destroy the Dira. Believe in me, brothers. At least I will give my record rounds. Yes, yes, you're right. To Ukraine. Yes, I know you like that one. I know you like that one. Also, I will make an app in Germany where Turkish people can sue other Turkish people who are talking shit about the state. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Yes. Download it. Download it right now. Thank you, brothers. I think that's Also, I am gonna use refugees as a pressure against the EU. <laughs> these idiots, right? Fucking white bitches in the West. We will use these billions of refugees to get massive money and funding from the EU. Because these white cunts are fucking retarded. It's gonna be great. You're gonna love it. Mashallah, Habibi. Believe in me, the Sultan. And belief in Turkey. Thank you. Thank you, Bruce. First Congress of the Military Junta. Block parties. Prime Minister Bruce Eschert was taken to the hospital. Yeah, hey, hey, hey. How long is this gonna go, man? What the fuck? I don't... <laughs> okay. Sure. Tell me we all know what you should and ethically do, but you must do for the lords invade Armenia. Inshallah. Sure, man. Sure. <clears throat> Let's see where the state goes. I actually don't understand the parties yet, who I want to be. I actually have no parties anymore. I can choose parties. Wait, was it here? No, here, yeah. Oh, the, the Junta is pretty strong now. I don't actually know which party I want to be, man. I like the House of Osman. I'm interested. Hardcore Islam will also be like, like warmongers. Also interesting. Terrorist attack. Go for Gensh party. Do you want to see real roleplay? Huh? This guy is standing in Istanbul in front of the parliament and he has a shield that says go for Gensh party. You know what? You know what? You know what our oh, friend Hussein oh, Kivri oh, will do to you? King in the castle, you're fucking gone, bro. Castle. Dude, nobody Don't knows you where you went. You're, you're missing. What happened? Huh? Dude, I just discovered your terrorist plot, you idiot. You're in fucking prison. That's what happens. Thank you for 1k bit seeker man supporting the Turkish state here with his nice investments. Appreciato molto. Okay, loyal arms, reorganize the military. Military opinion changes. Kurdish problem. Oh, I get the Kurdish xenophobia back. Oh, I kind of destroyed the xenophobia. Now it's coming back. Reorganize the military. I'm getting the xenophobia back. Turkey joins the F 35 program. Getting air superiority bonuses and 5% research speed. F-35 aircraft construction member and more terrorist attacks. <laughs> Increased consumer confidence. Oh, I got stagnation. Oh, nice. Economy going up a bit. Nice. Actually, so important. Fun fact, the Gench party leader was also banned from the country. This is high-level roleplay, man. You ever thought any different? Gene therapy and now CRISPR. Genetic engineering. We're gonna make the ultra turf, man. The baby is born instantly has a black mustache, bro. Build a wall on the Kurdistan border and make the Greeks pay for it. <laughs> this, this chat is going full mental and I love it. Okay. The Constitutional Court's decision on Erdogan. The Constitutional Court said Erdogan could not be a deputy. The Constitutional Court says Erdogan has a ban on politics, so Erdogan will not be able to take any political steps until the ban is lifted. If Erdogan wins the election, he will put the AKP in charge. I don't actually want to be Erdogan. I hope I can still change that. Oh, I get a massive economic bonus here. Again, guys, as I said, this game was going to be very long. I'm gonna for just literally free streams build up my economy. Even though I have no economy, man. There's nothing going on here. Let's have an industrial lease here. So maybe I can get some sifts. Wow. Is 
set a basic focus limit down style. What? Speak English, man. Jesus, fuck. You can't escape Erdogan? I studied for two exams for legit three months and still managed to fail. You fucking stupid mate. <laughs> Just kidding. That happens. That happens in life, man. What's important is that when you fail, you stand back up again and you don't hide in the corner and you set all the time. Be set for two days and then Greece leaves NATO. Oh, do you guys smell Chivapchichi? Uh, Hamas starts the new Intifada. With support from Syria, Hamas started a new uh, shit against Israel. Creation of the YTP. Terrorist attack. <clears throat> Greece leaves NATO. Oh, whoa, that never happened before. Israel declared one Hamas. Hamas? Okay, Hamas actually... Doesn't Hamas actually leave Palestine in real life? They do, yeah. Oh, shit. I'm not involved here, Twitch admins. I'm not involved. I'm just watching the game, bro. I'm just hanging out. There's a lot of war going on. And Israel is not winning at all. Uh oh Hamas only leads Gaza. Well, in this case, the same. Alter, voila, voila. You're going to fall developer. You know that, right? The Gensh party requests our support. Who are they here? Here, Gensh party. Who are you? Aut Autocracy. Oh, they're like dictators. Members of the party of the youth are asking for our support. The reason they want support is to ensure that their own party hangs the dam and holds power. I'm against you. I want the PP. The rise of the AKP. The AKP quickly began to gain power in the country. AKP rallies filled with so many people. At this rate, the country will fall to the hands. In my roleplay, I would say that the leader of the military realizes that the AKP is full of corrupt motherfuckers and I'm actually pushing anti-AKP propaganda and a terrorist attack. I am not reading this, man. Beneficial decision for the CHP. Kemal Dervish joins that party. Okay. I don't want to go with AKP, man. Feels dirty. <clears throat> Mm. Yeah, this focus tree is gonna take a long time, Chad. Israel can't take Gaza, man. It's gonna be very easy later. Oh, what? 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 Commands on the general staff. A uh, bunch of stability and command power. Just getting all the focuses out of the way. If you roleplay as Turkey, wouldn't it support Hamas? I do my own roleplay. That's roleplay. I do what I want. You guys never understand roleplay. My father served during the Intifada. It was so fucked that people were afraid to get in buses because of suicide bombings. Well, maybe if I unpause the game, something happens. Do satellites do anything? They do a lot, man. They do a lot. Which ideology are we gonna choose? I have no idea. There will be free elections at the end of the stream. But right now, we're just gonna grind a bit. Nothing's gonna happen for a long time. I'm slowly fixing my economy, getting my money, trying to get to stable growth. Gaza is totally hold holding, man. And that's the end of Gaza. Whoa! Whoa! In my roleplay, I call that out. I officially, in my roleplay, call out the Israeli warmongers for taking Gaza. We're very, very offended here. Oh, I have an election. Wait, I have an election? Let's go! What do you mean election? There says no elections. Okay, I think I have a bugged out game. I think we bugged out the game, boys. It happened. I have an election, which makes no sense. Let's see what happens. It's starting to feel like a buggy. The CHP is rising a bit and more terrorist attacks. Third of November elections. Can you read, you dumb cunt? Oh, so why is the DSP leading? The military junta is leading. Attack the DSP morons. Okay, this seems to get really laggy now. It didn't take the other two focuses. What are you talking about, man? Guantanamo Bay was made. Invite the controversial speaker for the campaign. I should not have an election here. Let's see what happens to this. Embargo Israel? I cannot afford that, dude. Negative. I got 8% Western support. What election are you talking about? In the old focus tree, you rushed the Junta. I literally had to 
What? I, I, I can't talk to you guys. Election defeat for Hussein. Okay, what? But now the national unity is still... Wins in a big upset. Okay, I think the role play is that a different general took over the army. Right? What? A different general took over the army. Number of Turkish citizens joining extremist groups is on the rise. Terror threat increases 1% more Salafism. Oh my fucking god. This guy is a general in real life. Yeah, we could roleplay a new general took over here. Okay, sure. Bit bit weird, man. That was a bit weird. It said general election, you moron. <laughs> Actually a good joke for once. Okay, man. Okay. I need to actually start taking uh, commanders, obviously. I'm forgetting. Infantry. Infantry. And next I'm taking... A logistic guy. Isik Kosaner. Let's take him next. They elected a new general. General election. Mer Lord Vadex, just delete yourself from the internet real quick, okay? And touch some grass. Also, I need to unlock the game. Mr. Stock photo. Okay, I'm taking... It's time to get some advisors to get army XP up. <sighs> Everything happened around those years. Uh-huh. So this focus is gonna take a long time, by the way. This is gonna take a while. Coop the constitution. Dismantle political parties. I become the only ruling party, man. But why do I leave, why do I work for free elections if I take over everything anyway? Let's just see where this goes. I actually really confused where this is all gonna go. I have no idea. Let's just see. So the mafia is destroyed. I don't need this anymore. Civil War in Afghanistan quiets down. Americans won, obviously, and Iraq was coming soon. It's all very weird, man. And I'm bringing back, I'm bringing back uh, hate against the Kurds. I don't, I didn't want to do that. Let's see what happens. I really don't know where this is gonna go. Investment from France. My only civs are from investments, quite literally. Angola took uh, free states. 3D wax printer. Large scale 3D printing. Technology is going ahead a bit. Revive to run. Bring democracy back. In nuke Syria. Yeah, just, just throw what you want at the streamer. Huh? It's totally gonna work. My god. What, do you think this is a church? Thank you for Sword Amen. Long live Turkey. I like the question mark at the end. Bon agreement. I like the question mark in the end, dude. I just have to see where this focus really goes. Turkish elections. Or pro NATO officers take charge. Then you get even a new focus tree. I want Turkish elections. Changes back to the democratic Turkey focus tree. Central bank decreases interest rate. Terrorist attack. Angola civil war. Go Hitler and invade Iraq. Oh, man, you guys are boring. Thank you, Wing Leader. Thank you very much. I've been streaming for four years now, and I think so many people in chat are so boring because they always make the same joke again and again. How am I going to feel like in 10 years? In 10 years, I'm going to sit here like an old, broken man. Hi, guys. Welcome back to the stream. We're going to play some Hi, Hi 4 for the nostalgia. What? Tommy, go Hitler and invade Iraq. You know, just, just bored, man, of these comments. Okay, I'm banning all parties for now. To fix the country, obviously. I'm just, wink, wink, fixing the country. Or I'm just fixing the country. Tanks on the street. Began to enter places where the Islamists were located. Islamists who saw the tanks were arrested. Ooh. Dude, I have infinite terrorist attacks. Stop! Release the Kraken. What? This is getting very meme now. What? That's his shitty opinion no one cares about. Anti-Salafist stuff. Oh my god, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, guys. Remind the world that the PKK is communist. 
I want to fix my economy first. I want to do stable growth. I released the Kraken. Okay, stagnation is back. That's good. Now I could fix some corruption. The whole idea of the military taking over was fixing the country. The CHP. Publicans are doing well. Okay, loyal arms. The military gets more opinion about me. Oh, yeah, this is a bit of a grind right now. We just have to finish this focus tree and then I think the real game starts again. Thank you, uh, Ralfen. Thank you, man. It means start the kill curts. I'm going to start banning people. As a, The retardation is going too far. I think as a streamer, if you don't ban some people in chat, it's like, it's like you're a kindergartner, right? You're a woman and you have 20 kids in the kindergarten. And everything is calm. And then the first kid starts like... Wah! 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 And if you don't already take care of that kid, then all the other kids are like... Huh? Ah, 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 ah. It's like a zombie virus. Everybody goes ham. And that's how you guys are. If I don't control you guys, man, you guys go completely nuts. Thank you, Lee Fock. You have to always sacrifice a guy every 10 minutes. So people calm down a bit more. It's because all those normal people are still in school. It's a bit late, man. I have one Sif, dude. I need my I need my civilian focus tree, man. It's the monkey virus, yeah. <sighs> Why would a woman be the kindergarten teacher? Because women, on average, uh, are more into care jobs because they are more emotional. Joining the invasion of Iraq. No, I, I, I want to play isolationist. It makes sense. Thank you, Shadow uh, Friend, man. Thank you very much. And thank you, Core Boss, for the 30, man. Appreciate it, Royce. Thank you, man. Even though I was, I, was, I was once abused in kindergarten, I will never forget that. That was nowadays, man. You will get sued to death for that. I will never forget. I will. There's just things you never forget. Dude, I was literally five years old, and it's one of my first core memories. I had a friend in school called Franz, and the whole kindergarten group was ready to go out for a walk, or I don't know. And we were in the room where the kids' clothing was, and everybody clothed themselves. I was like five years old. I totally remember this completely. And Franz, my friend, he was my friend. He will he will put on his black leather jacket. I'll never forget. He put Put on his black, black leather, leather jacket. This is a true story that I never forgot, man. Fuck me, dude. And, um... Sorry. And I go up to Franz, and I, I give him a slap on the back like a friend. Like, hey, Franz, what's up? Suddenly, right, and I swear to God, I remember it was not hard, and he didn't give a fuck. I'm like, hey, Franz, what's up? Suddenly, one of the women uh, caretakers of the kindergarten screams like crazy. Thank you, Gideva. Tommy, you piece of shit. Did you just hit Franz? And I'm a kid. I'm five years old. I don't understand. Like, what? 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 Uh, Jesus, can, can I talk for a second? Thank you, Zeus, for the 1K. Can I just talk? Can you stop pushing money into my face? And the woman goes completely nuts. I think nowadays she was just anti ginger or something. Thank you, uh, Sul Sul Stop. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you. ADHD. So, the group was leaving, but she took me. She took me by the arm. The good old grip. You know when, when the teachers will grip you here? Uh, that's the old grip. She will take me. She will go back into the main room of the kindergarten with me. And I swear to God, true story. She told me, this is a true story. I swear to God. And she told me to stand like this in the middle of the room and to not move. I swear to God, this is a true story. So I stood in the room like this and they were leaving. They were having a walk. I was alone in the room, standing there. And then the cleaning lady came in. I'll never forget. And the cleaning lady will literally do nothing. She will clean around me. I'm a five-year-old kid standing like this. And she will clean around me and do nothing. Fake? I swear. I swear on my unborn child's life that this is not a fake story, man. I swear to God. Swear to fucking God, dude. Nowadays, you will get sued for that shit. But that was just old times. 1995 or something. Chief of the Turkish Cypriots rejected the latest version of the UN nation's plan to reunite Cyprus, so Northern Cyprus remains independent. Fuck that. Cyprus belongs to Turkey. Swear to fucking god, man. That was the old ways back then. Thank you, max level nerd. I think I never... I don't remember. I think I never told my mom. I was five years old. I don't remember, man. But that was... That was legit fucking abuse. <laughs> like, legit, man. And I swear, I didn't even hit Franz. It was... She just didn't understand it that... Idiot woman. <sighs> like, what is the what the fuck is this? 
you wouldn't survive a day in the Balkans. I'm telling a story of when I was five, you complete. That's the first promo ban. Like, what a dumb ass comment. You complete nut job of a human. Whoa, Russia declared war in Belarus? Whoa, wait, 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 what? Jesus, man. Yo, man. Oh, shit. Lukashenko, huh? This is what happens when you can't suck Putin dick. Ay, 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 ay. Russia taking Belarus, dude. I tell I, I, I tell you this story, and your comment is, you wouldn't survive a day in the Balkans. You must be a little bit to make a comment like this. Like, you have to be a bit dumb. Central bank decreases the interest rate to 23, and the Iraq war is happening. I'm actually much more interested in what happens to Belarus, man. That's interesting. Declared a special operation. Piece of shit, Lukashenko, man. I feel very bad for the Belarusian people, man. Must be very hard to live in that fucking country. These elections are mad. I wish you could turn it off, man. It's very annoying. So Iraq is taken by the US and Belarus will become Russian. Interesting stuff right now, actually. Interesting, interesting history. I have to bring Turk, Turk, Kurdish xenophobia back, which I hate, man. Thank you, Legendary, for the 200 bits. I don't like doing this. I hope when, I'm, when I make my elections, I can integrate the Turks, uh, the Kurds more. I'm still very confused about this mod. I still don't know where this is going to go. Turkish USA crisis. Oh, I diplomatically insulted them because I didn't join the attack. Fuck you, USA, you warmonger. I will meet you soon in Iraq. Don't worry, man. <clears throat> Turkish consumers spend less. Transfer some shopping money. There's a 40% chance to get stagnation. Don't give me stagnation, piece of shit. I didn't get it. Okay, good. Oh my god, that was... The game always is pushing me towards stagnation. Fuck off. So, push economic reforms. I am fixing the economic sickness. Jenny Yurk. I'm modifying Jenny Yurk. Who? What? Yeah, the xenophobia is back. Does that mean the elect the can I make the xenophobia get go away again or I don't fucking this one also feels very buggy. This is the problem with these developers, man. War in Iraq and wow, well, Russia and next Belarus. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, that's the problem with these mods. Y you develop what the fuck? You developers always make your mods way too complicated, man. And that always leads to bugs and shit. Yeah, I can't fix the Kurds again. Ugh, really weird stuff right now. What? Cyprus has been divided. Inside riots? Lose 20 support? Why would I lose support? I wanna... What? Northern anti greek propaganda. Lose 5 support. Who? Why would I lose support? What? That is already too late. I didn't even know this existed. I'm really confused about everything. Cyprus has been divided between the Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus and the Republic of Cyprus since 1974. After a Greek sponsored group almost brought Cyprus into a union with Greece. What followed was Turkish protest that took the form of an invasion of Cyprus, splitting the island into two. The occupation of Cyprus is the second largest occupation of land in the modern world. Unification progress. Incite riots and anti greek propaganda. But the event is over anyway. I didn't even see the event. And Belarus has been annexed. That's very aggressive move by Russia, man. Yeah, I, I can't. Enosis conference. I'm so confused. This is like so complex. I don't even know what the fuck's happening. I know I'm out of depth, man. That's kind of interesting. Okay, out of depth. I have a massive earthquake in central Anatolia. Iraq was puppeted by the US. Okay, we have the Enosis conference now. Whatever the fuck that even means. I can start doing investments now. I have uh, no investments in the world, actually. <laughs> hmm. Okay, the conference did not happen. I have no idea, chat, what the fuck is happening this mod. It's really cool, but it's like almost too much. Like, you're going too far. Like, look at all the stuff. Send money to Cyprus. Send scientists to Cyprus. Support the industry. Unify Cyprus. Hmm. Thank you, Maritu. I mean, this is really cool. Thank you for the tier 2, brother. 
This is really cool, but I just... I'm a bit... But the conservatives have been re-elected. Okay, Western Outlook. Okay, sure. IBDAC attack. Two more truck bombs exploded in the headquarters of the ASBC bank. Uh, victory and Eurovision. I won the Eurovision song contest. <laughs> hey, man, we won the Eurovision song contest, man. Fuck yeah, dude. Like, I like this year. The game gives you uh, options to invade neighbors. I think that's really cool. So where's the Cypress stuff? Wait, and now the Cypress stuff is... Okay, it's right there. I don't know what I'm doing here. Turkish Cypress approval. Don't I want that to be high? I, I don't understand. I think whoever made this mod didn't speak native English, which is why everything's a little bit weird. I, I get it, right? No this against him. I'm investing a bit into stuff I'm taking over later anyway. What? What did I say? What? Just, just kidding, obviously. Iran gets the SCO membership. Isn't it anti-American? Oh, Iran, not Iraq. Sorry. Thank you, Emra. Chillin. Emra, chillin. Thank you, Emra. Okay, money should go up now, slowly. We're starting to get money now. Okay. Country is getting a bit better. I don't understand the Cyprus thing at all. I get my economic reforms. I then do economic movements. Making my economy much better, and then end the economic problem. I then do national purges. Oof. Stabilize regime, peace propaganda, and then open elections. Let's see what's gonna happen. Who won Afghanistan? What do you think won, man? What do you, who do you think won? The people that don't have healthcare because of their army, or the goat farmers? Can you play winning some of your region from Surtop Irinir? Nah, I'm they're scared of DMCA. Data mining. We're gonna get some cryptocurrency here. And I would like to invest a little bit more. To start my investment portfolio to go up. Nice, this is good for the economy. Let's get two sifts, man. Foreign investments are being attracted. And for once, I still only have one sif. Okay, I had a massive terrorist attack here. I have to repair that. I'm really working on this Cyprus stuff. Okay, they became... I did something here. Whatever that means. I'm pressing the buttons. I don't know what the fuck's gonna happen here, but I'm pressing the buttons. Don't even ask. In my game, Russia just selected Russian Outlook 2000. Guess the game will be lame. It is what it is, man. You just made it, Greek. Yeah, I feel like... But why would I click buttons to... How does that... What? Like, I, I made Cyprus hate me. I paid for Cyprus to hate me. Why would I do that? Just feel what the buttons do? I mean, using your brain, obviously, if Turkey spends stuff on Cyprus, it should be pro-Turkey. Why in the world would you design a system that's anti-Turkish? Makes no sense. Lisa's mom is right here. Nicosia, she's right there right now. Thank you, Toby. It makes no sense. This this all makes no sense to me. For, for, this is for false flag operations. Oh, it's that makes sense. People saying it's for false flag operations. I'm gonna uh, make a, a Cyprus division. I'm gonna make a Cyprus division for that then. One, two, three with two. Sorry, one sec. Wait, I can't even go there. Why, why would I not be able to go there? Why? Why would I? Like, what? Like, why? Oh my god, eh? Jesus Christ. Yeah, I have military access. You cannot draw front lines here. Yes, it's a separate country, but you see this right here? It's not yours. Are you... Are you <sighs> Before you use your slimy fingers on your keyboard, you open your eyes. You see these buttons here? You know what they mean? You know what I mean, bro? But I can't, I can't do anything. This guy's not even leaving. That's fucking weird, man. Uh, I have an idea how to uh, fix this bug. I have one idea how to fix this bug. Watch me here. I have an idea to fix this. If you just click yourself. Oh, actually, positive here. 21st century warfare. Yeah, clicking the port could maybe uh, help with this bug. Fama Gusta. And now you click this button. Nah, even that doesn't work. 
What in the world, man? Buggy piece of shit. Buggy piece of shit. Yeah, fuck it. I don't care, man. You are not in a port. You win this one, chat. You win this one. I am actually not in a port. Good job, chat. Good job, chat. Hey, good job, chat. Okay. Uh, Kemal is champion. Adaptable. Mm, this guy seems good with his logistic wizard. Abdullah Recep. Recep. Okay. Headquarters Ankara. Ankara. Offensive doctrine. Improvisation expert. May, may, may. Uh, this is the Cyprus Intervention Force. Okay, I'm ready for anything in Cyprus. I don't really know what's gonna happen there. I got a lot of doctrines. Nice. And I can really start investing into stuff. Oh, oh Kurdistan ain't liking my investments. Okay, nobody likes my investments. Jesus. Okay, Georgia likes my investments. Good. 13 billion. My investment portfolio is going up. Good. What kind of tank does Turkey have? Uh, thank you, Maple. The M60A3T from 1965. I obviously have to work on this stuff later. Not yet, though. It's too early. I gotta fix my focus tree first. Try to invest in Greece and puppet them for the memes. I'm not playing for memes, you know that, right? I'm playing for amazing roleplay. That's what I'm playing for, sir. Okay, Turkey starts investing. Since the military took over, the country's actually doing much better. I still don't get this Cyprus stuff at all, man. I, 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 uh, the false flag operations make sense. I'm trying to have false flag operations or something. <clears throat> the percent is approval of unification, not approval of your country. You are anti-unification, so you want low support. That actually makes sense, man. That's actually one guy in chat that actually makes sense for once. Okay, I'm fixing the Turkish economy again. Then we get economic movements, and then we end the economic problem in Turkey. I'm a Nakoyam gameplay. Mobilized guardians of Kemalism. Okay, I don't want them to unify. Maybe she'll take Crimea. Yeah, just randomly say random shit. Okay, that totally is useless right now. Real roleplay as Turks will be to genocide every single Kurd and Armenian. Kek W. Yeah, very funny, everybody. Kek W in the chat. What a funny guy, man. <laughs> what a cool comment. <laughs> Thank you, Vol Volo. Volo. <laughs> Kek W. <laughs> Jesus, fuck me, man. You guys are a bunch of monkeys. Greece, you like me? Greece likes me. Oh, you like Turkish money, huh? Malaka! Malaka! I want fast growth and then I think I stop. I'm not gonna do economic boom. I want my economic tree, man. I'm so stuck in this focus tree right now. Well, patience. Patience in this content. You should invest and keep up stores in Europe. So funny, man! Tommy plays turkey and you make a keep up uh, joke? Never heard that before today. Another Keck W in chat, guys. Keck W, so many fucking... I can't, I can't in the chat. So many comedians over here. Wow. Wow. So funny. Next you're gonna say, Tommy, name your drones by a raptor. <laughs> <laughs> Collapsing house? Fuck off, dude. Why the fuck am I... The game always tries to put me my economy down. Fuck off. Oh, come on, man. Stop fucking my economy. Oh, fuck you. I think I'm not supposed to go to stable growth. I think. What do you go through this campaign? Not ending up in an insane asylum IRL. That is me goal, brother. Dude, these terrorist attacks. Jesus Christ. Lots of terrorism, brother. <sighs> Maybe I could make the corruption go down at least once. Be nice. Yeah, let's go for corruption. 
Thank you, Yana Duck. I'm getting a bit hungry, IRL. Thank you, Yanar. Tommy is dealing with this miracle. Evil means foreign powers in elegance language. Okay. Economic movements. I still, dude, I'm building so much economy and it's not happening at all. This country is a mess, dude. It's gonna take 10 years until this country is gonna have one shift, man. <clears throat> Human genome project. Technology wise, we're doing not so bad. I still need much more um, resource slots, though. I am live in Turkey and there are very bad economy and people hate Erdogan. You live? I should follow your channel. In this game, you just spend so in factories to increase your economy and have low tax, and then when you're rich, you get all the policies. Wow, you're playing meta in a single player game. Good for you, bro. Um, I'm actually reaching the end of my line. Good, that's good. We're actually reaching the end of our economic line. Saddam is gone. Saddam is bye bye. Why are you building offices? You should be making SIFs. How about you suck a massive penis? What does the 2G and 3G infrastructure do in this mod? It makes you build buildings faster. I think. Improve local construction speed, yeah. It's like a, a, a second infrastructure. In a way. So, I'm just grinding the focus tree, grinding the focus tree. This USA stuff makes no sense to me. I, I just... If you want to go emerging, like if you want to be pro-USA Turkey, you should do that. Not interested in that, to be honest. You gotta play China one day. It's so much fun. I will. Uh, internet is like really good infrastructure. Yeah. Offices, they give you money. Offices give you money. Talking about retardation in video games. Wasn't there a guy that... That made a Tommy K. Hoi format? Anyway. Exploiting gaps... The terror threat increases a lot. Syrian jihadists have crossed into Turkey. Dude, I need to fight these jihadis. Yo, 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 yo. I, I actually should probably take that shit serious, huh? Wait, what is that? Yo, industrial programs. Dude, there's so much new shit. I didn't see that. Toki means mass housing development. And Turkey's government backed housing agency. Founded in 1984, Toki carries out projects and activities primarily throughout Turkey in line with the government's building and mass housing priorities. Yo, I didn't even see this. I get SIFs, but it's pro-nationalist. Oh, shit. Okay, how do I fuck up the jihadi jaunts? Dude, there was an anti-jihad thing somewhere. Uh, Oh, my fucking God. Dude, where's the anti-Islam thing? Here. Crack down the Muslim Brotherhood. Subsidize... Salafism. Legalize alcohol in hotels and clubs. Limit female employment options. Expand female employment options. This is not really fucking up the... This is actually not the terrorist threat. Where is the terrorist threat? Where will I see my current... I hear Turkey. Oh, I have high radicalization and sustainable... Oh, oh this is the anti-terrorism. Fund the de-radicalization program, conduct counter-terrorist training, and raid terrorist hideouts. Okay, finally I did something about the terrorists. I didn't think about that. Okay, there's so much to do in this mod. It's mental. Mental, mental, mental. Let's subsidize some in, uh, SIFs. So maybe I, I, I will build something. I'm looking back for my Cypress thing. I want to finish the Cypress thing. I don't want Cypress to unite. That's what's going on there. Also, in a second, I'm going down in corruption. Okay. Uh, let's uh, invest more into people. To make my portfolio bigger and gain more money. Okay. You have to spam 24-7 to make terrorists go away. Our intelligence service have successfully located foreign jihadists. Let's hope we can catch them. Okay, I'm reaching the end of the research. That's nice, I like that. I don't need railway speed. Uh, that means I can maybe focus on some cool stuff for now. Like the 3G network. Okay. Focus tree is slowly coming to an end. Feels very grindy. But it is what it is. 
You should play 20 years in this game, makes sense. What about the decision at the bottom to give money to North Cyprus? Does it help you? I can't build up North Cyprus, but I don't know why I will do that right now. I, I, I don't know. I'd rather also have PP right now and... No, no, don't do stable growth. That always leaves you. What is that money? Why will I build up Cyprus? I don't... You know, I need PP for other stuff. Why will I build that up right now? I don't get it. These terrorist attacks, my god. Civilians killed in a counter-terrorist raid. I actually got more radicalization. Oh my god, hold on. Okay, end the economic problems of Turkey. Good. So at 360, I make the corruption lower. I'm doing northern anti-Greek propaganda. And I'm going back to the terrorism stuff. Which didn't work so well. Okay, I'm once again funding it and I'm raiding terrorist hideouts. Command power doesn't mean shit to me. Myanmar cracks down on the protesters. Yeah, nothing changed yet. I need to make my radicalization higher. Foreign jihadists have been successfully apprehended. My terror threat goes down. Naturalable. No, it actually didn't go down. Bullshit. Send training missions. Qatari counter-terror training will be more effective, but our advisors may be targeted by jihadists. Why would I go to other countries for anti-terror training? I don't understand. I make other people's anti-terrorism better. I'm sending Qatar and Iraq anti-terrorist forces. Why not? I don't even know why, but let's do it. Sure. Okay. Launch airstrikes against terrorists. Thank you, Dark Banana. It's actually a cool system how you fig uh, figure out terrorism. It's kind of very interesting. It's just, I always feel like there's too much going on in this game. Like, fuck me. It's cool, but also uncool. But it's more cool. You yeah, and the terrorist force who can't apprehend the terrorists in Turkey are going to help other countries. Yes. Because politics is all about prospects of fake power, man. Okay, let's get the corruption down here. Widespread corruption, not so good for me. And I'm fixing corruption a little bit. Very nice. I would like to have my final investment here in Macedonia. And 15 investments are running. 200 billion investment portfolio. Good. <clears throat> the free elections are going to be interesting. Civilians killed in another counter-terrorist raid. Oh my god, Elder. This counter-terrorism shit is not going so well, is it? It's actually counterproductive. China blockades Taiwanese lands. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, why would one want to switch the economy law to stagnation versus stable fast growth? Because it obviously gets you bonuses, obviously. For example, stagnation, you lose stability, construction speed, and taxes. The better your economy is, the more bonuses you get. More stability, more construction speed, and more taxes. For example, economic boom gives you 120% construction speed, for stability, and 10% more taxes. Very big. But in this game, if I go into these three... There's random events triggering that make me go down again, which seems to be a thing in this mod, not in normal Millennium Dawn. It's like in EU4, when you have free stability in EU4, there's certain events by the AI that make you, that fuck you over with that. Which is why I don't want to click it anymore, man. Counter-terrorist training. Trying to get my terrorism lower, man. Fucking elections, dude. The main reason to invade these countries is so they don't have to get their shitty election messages anymore. You cannot invest in into your own country, no. You can show division templates. Uh, there, I didn't make any yet. I didn't make any yet. Terrorists actually have been killed and captured. Nice. Did that actually do something? That didn't change anything, dude. I'm gonna keep investing. Um, national purges. We're purging a lot of people that the military deems to be assholes. Reclaim Greece? Question mark. I need a break, man. You know that feeling when you open your fridge and you're looking for food, even though you know there's no food in it? It's interesting. These fucking elections, man. Most annoying. Let me look for some food. 
I found some chocolate. Aren't the operations you're doing in other countries? These events are always... Come on, I can't even answer that. Does this event look to you like another country? Does anything here look like another country? Come on, bro. Come on. I'm actually finally doing stuff against the terrorists. But that stuff isn't going lower, man. Moderate threat and high are still staying. Hmm. Your threat level actually did go down. Did it? Did I have substantial threat first? Oh, it actually went down? Okay, thank you. I didn't see that. It actually goes down slowly. You have to really spam this anti-terrorist stuff a lot, huh? Verticalization is increasing, though. It was high the whole time. Fake news, man. Fake news. It was high the whole time. Ugh, I'm making a lot of money now, and I actually don't know what to do with it. I just thought I crashed the game, dude. Oh, God. I have a lot of money right now. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I actually have free sifts, man. That's pretty big for this country right now. Okay, peace propaganda. The war support's going down. Stability, open elections. Public elections will return. Lift ban of political parties and have elections. Do I maybe have to push a party? I still don't know who I want to play, man. Maybe I should once again ask you guys what we should do. Western, pro-Western. Fuck that. Terrorist killed and captured. Excavation. Okay, I have now a low threat, but I still have massive radicalization. Um, I finished this tree, kinda. Let's get the encryption bullshit. Uh, thank you, Ra. Thank you. Um... Pay your debt. Oh, shut up, you idiot. Um, I'm wondering that if I make Turkish elections, it's just like a real election where the best party wins, aka the National Unity just wins. I would like the Osmans. LDP. Random guy in chat says LDP. Yeah, let's play a pro Western party. That's gonna be fun as fuck, you idiot. Um, Non-aligned Salafist Center-right neoliberal hmm. I really don't know where to go politically with this with this shit man I really don't know where to go politically man No idea The house of Ottomans are the Ottomans Oh and I fought to the house of fucking McDonald's man Thank you for that tip Man, you guys are on a road today, huh? You guys are ham today. Jesus Christ almighty. <sighs> and our earthquake. Turkey has a lot of earthquakes, huh? I'm scared that these elections will uh, just be normal elections and nothing really happens there. Hmm. Why would my cam freeze? That's really weird. That's very weird. Who knows though? I don't even ask questions anymore. Bozu Kartla, the Grey Wolves, Idealist Hearts in a Turkish far right organization. A movement affiliated with the Nationalist Movement Party, commonly described as ultra-nationalist, Islamic, and neo-fascist. Nationalist... I think the House of Osman is interesting. But then I have to I have to boost them right now, or what? It's gonna take 20 years until I boosted them up. I, I don't 
don't really understand this all right now, to be honest. Let's see where it goes. I just follow the focus tree. Let's just see where it goes. It makes no sense to me, but let's see where it goes. Go Turkish greens. Oh, can you just shut up, man? Thank you, Yamate. Thank you, man. Human genome project. Finish that. Okay. <clears throat> Reading Cheddar gives me a little headache, man. Like, it literally hurts a little bit. I'm not getting the radicalization on, though. Hmm. Okay, corruption has been lowered even more. Nice, nice, nice. Sub mode? I don't want to. Sub subs are equally taught, you know. Toxic K? Okay, sub mode. You win? Yeah, okay. He called me toxic. Subscriber mode? Okay. Shout out to uh, Shane Sess. Shane Sess, Jesus. Okay, 5% more research here. Research is gonna be very important in this country. I have a lot of money, which I don't know what to do with it. I'm actually investing heavily. Oh, they don't want me to invest? Okay, they want me to invest. Stabilize the regime. Turkey's slowly getting stabilized. Azerbaijan asks for a debt bailout. Which gives me influence over them. Yes. That's how I can actually use money. I'm starting to get influence over Azerbaijan. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, uh, thank you, Dilhar. I don't think these elections will... If you stay with the military, you actually get a new military uh, Yunta tree. Interesting. We could just stay with the military. I, I, hmm. I really, really don't know where I am going to go with this game, dude. I generally have no idea. Brain dead, Tommy can't read. Yeah, sure, man, whatever. Quick save time. I like this concept of whatever I do is the decision, man. Whatever is decided, it happens. Military Junta is interesting, right? But do they have an industry tree? Turkish officers are cooping and democracy is gone. Pro NATO officers take charge of Turkey. Change the national focus tree to the new military junta tree, and Adidin Unal takes over the Nationalist Outlook Party. I'm actually kind of interested, I don't know. Thank you, Bronx Gaming. Policies are also updated with uh, political power, so. If you, uh, if you, with the left focus on the bottom, AKP will win the elections. But why would you say that? Right here, they will not. Is there random lore, or does this count here? That's kind of my question. I don't understand. Um, okay, encryption, decryption is good. Boosting the party only affects the parties in that other group. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you, man. France invests in me. I knew it. There it is. No, I'm not even reacting to it. Now, I need to learn to not react to every dumb shit in chat. I need to learn that as a big streamer, I, if I want to be bigger, I need to learn to not read everything in chat. Because otherwise, I'm going to jump out of the window by the time I'm 32 years old. Every time you go sub, more people start subbing? Not really. It's the same frequency of subs. What actually helps the frequency of subs on a Twitch channel is when the streamer says, Twitch Prime, guys, check your Prime right now. Is it ready? You Did you know you can connect your mom's Amazon Prime account with your Twitch account? And for free, you can sub to your favorite streamer once a month. What a privilege. What a support to your favorite streamer that you want to support, don't you? Twitch Prime, not a crime. Check it out. Thank you, Donnie. Thank you, Donnie Donnie. I get uh, uh, Tunisian election uh, stuff. Luax with the Prime. Thank you, sir. Preciato Cresus with the Prime. That's how you raise the frequency of subs, brother. Because legit, so many people don't know their Prime is ready. Like, I, I have Twitch Prime. I'm not using it for months, for years. Wow, 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 I could sub to someone. I always nice. forget. Thank you, more timer. Thank you for the five blue engineer, bro. Thank you, man. How's your magic card collection going? I'm going chill. I want to only spend 100 euros a month. Today, I sold my first card officially. It has arrived. I got 10 euros on my card account. Thank you, Blue Man. I swear to God. Thank you, man. 
I'm now gonna uh, sell my Otavara city card because it's in German. I want to replace it. I'm selling it again, and I'm getting the English version. Thank you, North Floki. Uh, I'm still waiting for one of my Kamigawa legendary forests, which hasn't arrived in a month. I might have to cancel that order. Open elections. Let's just see what happens here. I really don't get it. And let's do Wi-Fi. Then I want to get the white legendary Japanese one. And then I think I want to buy Teferi the Time Reveler in legendary, which is expensive. That's going to cost a lot of money. George Bush has been reelected. It's already 2004, man. Uh, when you play alone, this game is much faster. Thank you, Floki, for the Prime. Oh, this terrorism shit is so annoying. I cannot make radicalization go down. Thank you, Uja and Dave. Appreciate it, boys. Thank you, man. I just finished Sopranos today. What a masterpiece of a show. The ending was just genius. So that man, I love reading that man. I love reading that dude. Serbia just took Montenegro. Uh, did they? Thank you, Twitch Green man. Terrorism, terrorism, terrorism. My God. Thank you very much, brother man. Okay, even Tur uh, Greece doesn't want to get invested anymore. Nobody wants me to invest in them. Pieces of shit. Hey, Egypt, you and me? Okay. Everybody hates Trokey, man. Who is watching Severance on Apple TV? The question should be who watches Apple TV? Thank you. One or zero for the Prime. Can you decrease the recognition by raising stability? Read the thing above fighting. I'm not gonna read this. Fight corruption, increase stability, and grow the economy. You're a fucking genius, man. Imagine actually listening to someone. You're actually right. Stability and economy decides radicalization. That's very real, man. The more economically fucked the country is, the more people radicalize. That actually makes a lot of sense. Open election. I think I want to stay with the Junta. I just really hope they have the... the I think that I hope they have a good tree, man. I really don't know what's gonna happen here. I might actually, as Dima said, make a save file before I take the final focus. Hmm. <clears throat> this is why the US is radicalized now. Well, you don't see a lot of US citizens joining fucking ISIS, you complete monkey. Um, oh, I actually had, I can actually do this. Advanced computers, more and more research speed coming in. Normally, you have 100% at this point with big nations. I only have 50, so Turkey is very behind here. Uh, how, how, what happened to my Cyprus shit? I totally forgot about Cyprus, man. Move an embassy to Jerusalem. Afyon's name changed to Afyon Karisa. Sure, man. Mm -hmm. Remind the world that the PKK is t terrorists. That's a one-time event, so I'm taking that. Commun they're communists, not terrorists. I mean, there's a difference. Chat said there's a way to form Turkic Union to run. I have no idea, bro. When Dota 2, 2037, when I'm unbanned. Wait, elections are happening? This is very bugged. Public elections will be held. Okay, I have elections, which will just be ultra won by the military. The role play of this game right now is that the Turkish people are in love with the military junta because they're so much better than everyone else. And they keep voting for the military. Thank you, Red Willy. Thank you, man. Long time to see it through. They're voting for the national unity uh, movement because everyone else sucks. So in a way, the Turkish people want me to play the military junta. They're literally begging me for it in a way. on having a child. I can actually invest in Russia. I obviously should make deals with Russia. They're nationalists like me. It makes total sense that I make big deals with them. And yeah, I just massively won the election. And I have to form a government now. I just massively won the election. Sorry, I need to fix this. With the DP, I could make a coalition. And I formed a government with the DP, pro-Western aut autocracy, with the military junta. And that's my new government, a coalition, which is not shown yet. It's actually shown. That's my politics. That's what the people voted for. Kurdish election, KDP Western Outlook has won. Aren't they guaranteed? Nah, later. 
but I could still vote that the military junta rules forever. Hmm. Huh, I really don't know where to go with this, man. I can't even afford a spy agency, dude. I'm so broke. I'm gonna do nothing for another two hours. Yo! What happened? Why is it sub only? What do you think? What do you think? Military Junta has a focus street that has war goals. Interesting. But you know me, man. I'm a big sucker for uh, an industry uh, tree. And to be honest, uh, the focus tree before had an amazing industry tree, man. I just kind of hope that the Junta has an industry tree. I'm gonna make a save file in a sec. In 30 days, we make a save file and then let's see. I think I'm deciding to stay with the military. Thank you, El Erecose, for the prime. Thank you, Capri. Thank you, thank you, thank you, man. Back to 5k subs on our way. Islamic State of Somalia. Oh, ISIS. Keep up the great work for Turkey. Oh, shit. I'll shab up. I'll shab up. Thank you, Flujo. Thank you, man. 18 months and still no girlfriend. Maybe you should just get a wife with pillow, man, at this point. Could work. I'll shab up. Sounds like something you can order in an Arabian restaurant. One all shabab, please, with rice. I have 28 months and no girlfriend. Come on, man. What's up, Bokwin? Why make an industry when you can steal others? Let's... I'm gonna make a safe file, see what happens. I actually want to stay with the military. I... I don't know. All these other parties seem like a bunch of idiots. Turkish consumer spent less, and once again, I lose my industry. Oh, dude, come on. Stop give pff. There's like these events that just kill your industry the whole time. It's cool, it makes the game harder, but come on. Okay, let's make a save file. Time machine. I am deciding, and you guys voted for it, actually, the chat voted for it. We are pro-NATO officers are becoming the leaders of Turkey. Let's see, let's see. Greece actually takes my investments now. Okay, 15 investments. I'm making a lot of money now. Lower your tax rates. I could actually do that, but you need PP for that, okay? You can always say that I, I, I don't, I need PP for other stuff though. Could actually load the tax rate a little bit. Actually, I only make six billion. I think you should shut the fuck up. Tommy, did you graduate law school? Do I look like that? What the fucking? What is this shit, man? There's an old school viewer who watched like a year ago. And you think in the last year I finished law school? You prep? Fucking dumbest question is that? Yeah, actually, uh, last year I took a break from streaming and finished fucking law degree. Sure, man. Turkish Cyprus went nationalist. That's what I need, right? That's good. I want that. I want that. Berat Karacham. Okay, let's see what next focus tree I get. Yeah, fuck the Iraq and USA stuff. USA can suck us. The Middle East belongs to... He's not smart enough, Kappa. Great comment once again. I mean, you're watching Tommy K all day. Let's see who's smarter. You can buy Lord of online now. Da da de, da 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 de. you, Oh, I talk shit about the US and now they invest in me. Shit. SPD won in Germany again? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's just reality. When your economy is dependent on the decision of bigger nations, you're always vulnerable to big swings. When the US prints money, Turkey will get flooded with dollars. Look at Mr. Uh, economy over here, man. Trash talking of viewers kick W. Imagine Tommy K trash talking his viewers. That's wow. What? That happens? Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I really wonder what the new focus tree is going to look like. So far, I have for four, five years, I, did, I don't have a single sift that's my own. I don't have any mills. I don't have any research power to research anything. Turkey has zero airplane stuff. Literally, if you make a paper plane right now, you have a better air force than Turkey. Look, I have... I don't even have paper planes. Bayraktar. A Syrian missile crashed into Turkish borders. A Syrian missile crashed into Kirikin district of Hatyai. The missile caused the explosion of two separate points 25 kilometers away from the Syrian border. The general staff informed the Turkish staff about the issue and reported their sadness. 
said. Habibi. Habibi, Bruda. I know about that. I know about that. Sad. I don't have any shifts. Also, Toby doesn't build any shifts. Fuck off, you dumb idiot. Actually, the National Unity Party lost some power here. Yes, sir. Do you can it? Man, that focus here was a grind, man. A bit boring. Uh, let's see what happens next. Please tell me I get an industry tree. If you don't give Tommy K an industry tree, he's gonna be very sad. Very sad. By the way, Chad, is there any other sub mods from Lame Dawn yet? I mean, it just came out some days ago. But I guess in the future we will see a lot of them. Okay, I got Wi-Fi. Industry's looking good. I think for the first time. Oh no, we just unlocked the new the new year. I was about to say I can actually start researching a pool and stuff, but I really can't right now. I would like to get off stagnation again. <clears throat> <laughs> Here we go, the big moments. The new military Junta focus tree. Let's see how much time the developer put into that focus tree. Because I wouldn't think he put much time into that, I would think. Because he probably is giving Adogan and shit more, more stuff. Thank you, Soda Mojo, my brother, man. Appreciate it. Red Willy, man, you're a fucking comedian. You've been gone for so long because you were on a comedic tour, huh? 15 months with with Amy Schumer, probably. Okay! Please tell me I have a good tree. Oh, oh, mm. Not bad. Turkish Union policies. Turkish. Wait, what, Alter? That's the European Union, but with Turkey. Wait, what? What? That's. <laughs> What the fuck, Alter? That's the European Union as Turkey. That's actually insanely cool. That's the Turan path. Fuck, that's really cool. The Turkish Empire. Turkey will now be known as Turkey. Amazing. That's actually pretty sick. What do I have? Okay, COVID-19, 2003. And that's just kind of my main focus tree. Not that impressive, but why the fuck not? I, have a, I actually have an industry tree. Is that industry? That's industry. That's industry. NATO policies? Turkish forces tree. Yo, I need, I'm looking for a good old brother, brother. What I need is motherfucking research, man. Universities right here. Dude, I only get one research slot. Fuck. Turkish carrier project. That's pretty sick. Dude, I only get one research slot. Not two. Two. Okay. So I'm rushing the, I'm rushing universities. Okay. That's the focus we are playing. Fuck it. Let's just see what happens. Dude, there's a Turan focus tree. That's insane. I a coup to the old coup plotters. I'm retiring a bunch of officers. Fuck it. I like this focus tree. Let's let's play him. Let's play the military man. Fuck it. Not a, they don't have a lot of research though, unfortunately. I gotta work on that. Well chat, I will now be AFK for two more hours building an industry man. You don't even get that much industry. Jesus, this is kinda hard. I'm actually switching to sifts. The guy, the guy is totally right. The guy in chat is actually correct a bit. I, don't, I, I, always, I always felt like that sort of events give me sifts, right? I thought that something's gonna happen in the game, giving me sifts, but it doesn't look like it, dude. Ain't looking like I'm getting a lot of civvies here. This is forty-five percent. I'm gonna work on these sifts, man. They're working access of satellites. Blah blah blah. You wasted six years on two GKW. They have never been built. Makes no sense your comment. Okay, I'm gonna be in the industry focus here for a while. Bunch of shit. OMTS. Okay, I finished everything here. I need to go into this tree. Self-replicating 3D printers. Looks like the continuous focus thing is blocking shit. Looks like the continuous... I will... It actually is blocking shit. Oh... It's not that important, but... Actually, it is blocking shit. Oh, man. Well, it's... It's a sub mod. Humans make mistakes. 
I never want to complain too much. I want, just want to follow the storyline, and if it becomes epic, it becomes epic. If it if it becomes shit, it becomes shit. We will see what happens, man. Spank the economic decisions for plus three sifts and twenty. Oh, you mean I I know what you're talking about. Sure, you're right. Industrial complexes, true. Okay, I'm doing a nationalist propaganda campaign. And I can actually just suspend elections, man. Fuck it. No more elections, baby. The military is the boss now. I'm not gonna fuck with this anymore. Even though I can switch my focus tree if uh, another... Uh, interesting, man. But I wanna... Let's stay in this focus tree for now, man. Like, come on. Advanced computers. Okay, it looks like I finally found my... Radicalization goes down. I finally found my, my, my... Hello? Okay. I finally found my thing. I found my politics. I'm not gonna join the EU. I'm not gonna join the EU. I'm not gonna join the EU. Don't care about NATO. Don't care about Shanghai bullshit. Um, the Cyprus stuff is still really weird to me. I don't get it at all. I went with military, yeah. Let's just see what happens, man. But the Turan tree looks insanely cool. Imagine we form Turan. That would be massive. Yeah, I'm actually excited. It's gonna take hours. It's gonna be long. But this, this, this is forming the Turkish World Empire. I'm interested. Down here, you actually get. Why oh, you steal economy from Azerbaijan? A portion of Armenia. Turkey wants to partition Armenia. A lot of cool stuff is still happening. I'm excited. I'm not in any way, shape, or form the the. Uh, the uh the 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 uh demotivated here this is mad fun the banner of populism the only negative side which in my opinion is not negative i'm gonna be here a long time i'm gonna sit you afk taking focuses unfortunately i don't know what the focus is here there must be some war stuff and i'm already playing speed five okay reconfigure an economic plan let's go let's go Go machine learning, sociable machines, looking for some investments. 15, there we go. But I was still taken by Russia. That's like the first big thing in this game here. Oh, but what will I do for more sifts, man? Actually, five sifts now. That's that's new. And after this, I embrace etatism. You get a tatism, which gives you a bunch of bonuses and minus five consumer goods. I'm a big fan of that. I have 18 sips in consumer goods. That's very, very nice. After this, I need to just rush the uh, university. I really want that. Destroy the annuity system in Istanbul. Wait, I'm destroying massive instant infantry in Trakia. Why would I fucking do that? And then you rebuild all of that in Istanbul. You bring industry from Trakia to Istanbul. And then you become an economic powerhouse, which needs 150 factories. Ay, ay, ay. Ankara factory plane. I don't know. Most of these focuses are kind of useless. Step by step to the European Union. Ah, oh, fuck the European Union. I, I joined the Copenhagen criteria for the European Union. So, I'm rushing to university, and then I just do the four sifts here, and then I'm done. The rest is not interesting to me. Yes, the rest is not interesting to me. And then I go into this main tree here, which also ends up with a research slot. NATO and Turkish NATO ship and join Russia. Hmm. I could stay in NATO and kill all the enemies of NATO. We will see. I really don't know where this goes. This is interesting. Let's just see where we go. Right now, I just have to be AFK doing focuses. Not much gonna happen here. I actually have negative PP. Because I'm a police state. Oh, shit. Is that bad? That's actually bad. But you get massive stability and stuff. Oh, I gotta fix my country a bit, boys. Jesus. I have negative PP? How is that even a thing? Jesus Christ, developer. What the fuck are we doing? Maybe that gets fixed in the main tree. You become the third... Okay, this is how you fix it. Right here. Turkish military dictatorship. You get more PP. Unite the people. Hunt down all the terrorists. Southern defense line. Turkish Kurdistan. Return interventionalism. A lot of cool stuff is going to happen. Arrest Democrats. Withdraw from European laws. Embrace Turkish values. 
Okay, this is fucking epic, man. I can't wait. This is fun. Do you need to wait to get 150 factories? Yeah, sure, sure. But yeah, let me just first of all have this little industry industry program. Gonna take a while. And then we're gonna go into the main tree. Dude, this terrorism is getting ultra annoying. I still don't understand what happens in Cyprus here. Oh wait, do I have to make this become zero before the British kill me or something? Well, I have no more PP, it's totally gone. Maybe I should fix my fix my PP first. Wait, now it's going up again. Ah, because I don't have a focus. Maybe I, I want the I want the university. I'm not saying no to university. Fuck Cyprus, man. I'm getting a tatism. Minus five consumer goods, way too good. Way too good. Then two mils, infrastructure, four mils, five stability, a hundred billion. I have money though. And then I get the university in eastern Trakia. That's my current operation of affairs. But obviously the political power hurts right now. I might even lose Cyprus here. But we're gonna get it back, don't worry. I would like to have more army XP. But yeah, I, I'm out of military. I, I'm, I can't do anything right now. We literally just have to chill here and do nothing. Thank you, Tex Guzzi. Thank you, man. Yeah, this campaign is gonna take a while. My party actually is losing massive support. I think the trucks don't like my dictatorship. Ay, ay, ay. Imagine having sifs. Your chat. Your. I don't have much to do. Let's do some questions from the date, date card game. Let's do some questions from the date card game, guys. Welcome back to ba -ba 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 -ba. Egomaniac Streamer answers questions about himself because he loves himself way too much. Welcome back, guys. Thank you, Shaku. I don't have anything to do on the stream right now because I'm just doing my focus tree. So we are going to answer some questions here from the legendary question card deck. Let me draw a question and see what question we are doing. You're actually gaining PP now? Why? UK Brexit? Why? I don't understand, man. Interest rate? I don't understand, man. What is the question? If you wrote the book, what would the book be about? Ah, let me think, let me think. What would I, the amazing streamer, write about, everybody? Okay, let's get Cas9 gene editing. That means humans can be used as Cas. It's very easy. If I would ever write a book, it would be one of these shitty motivational books. It would be like, How to Make It by Tommy K. It would be like stories, how I was from the ghetto, and then how you can make it. It would be one of these shit books, you know, like, to motivate you. Disgusting, I know, I know, disgusting. And now it's going down again. No, it, it's not going down, it's just the events bringing me down or some shit. How to gain money, which is bullshit. <sighs> How to play a four with half a brain. How to read chat without killing yourself. That would be a good one. Streamers around the world will read that shit. I just found the Millennium Dawn mod. If you select the C square and zoom all the way out, the time zooms faster. What the fuck? I mean, I'm fine, I don't give a shit, man. But that's funny. How to be as cool as Red Willy. Red Willy, you're gonna get banned soon. I can always smell it, man. Three more days, this guy is fucking banned. Epic book. Let's get to the next question. Describe a friend or acquaintance you are envious of and why. Describe a friend or acquaintance that you are jealous of and why. Okay, a massive um, road program in Turkey. A friend that you're jealous of. I'm such a narcissistic cunt, man. I I love myself too much. It's not a friend or acquaintance, but I'm always envious of Lyric. Because Lyric can play whatever game he wants. And, and he's always funny, always entertaining, always 10k viewers. I envy that a bit. I look up to Lyric. Um, thank you, Ludwig. I'm a bit envious of Marconi and his muscles. Yes, I gotta work on that. Thank you, Ludwig, man. Sure. Tony is better at magic. Shut, fuck, fuck off, you... Anyway, next question, next question. What is your view of therapy? Have, have you ever had therapy and what did it do for you? Therapy, stock market boom. I got a boom for once, Jesus Christ, man. Fuck yeah. Finally, a little boom boom. 
I never had therapy. I'm not thinking of getting therapy. I agree that therapy should exist and can help people. I also think that some people in the Western world go to therapy just for attention seeking. Like they actually don't need the help, but a lot of people need the help. And therapy is very important. And it's a beautiful thing that we live in such a privileged Western world where we have something like this. Yeah, interesting. I reached a point where I ask myself questions because I'm so bored right now. Like normally you guys ask me questions. Now I, I, I ask myself questions. That is the highest level of narcissism achieved on this channel ever. But it's good content, so we're gonna keep going. Next question, guys. What kind of faults are you particularly tolerant of in others? And which are you less tolerant of? What kind of faults am I tolerant in others? Oh. Let's ask you too, chat. What kind of faults and others are you tolerant about? What's like a good answer? <clears throat> I think I've always been very tolerant towards stupid people in the way that I was raised in a neighborhood and in a family that is not the ultra most educated. And it was always okay for me when I was sitting around people that said really dumb shit and I just felt like, ah, sure, whatever, man. Who cares? Uh, which also gave me the ability to handle chat. Grammar? Yeah, true. You could look over grammar, sure. Being weirdos? Yeah, that's a good answer. Be uh, smokers. Mm. Yeah, weirdos. That's something you can be tolerant about. If your friends are weirdos, that's a good good answer. <clears throat> no one said what you're not tolerant of yet. You guys already fucked the question. Jesus Christ. Okay, the next question. You fucked it up. You spoiled it. You spoiled it. You spoiled it. What do you think might be the most endearing about you? What's endearing? Endearing. Endearing. Inspiring affection. Makes people like me. Endearing means what makes you like what makes people like you, right? Likeable. Chat, what do you what do you I wanna ask you as a whole, right? I don't wanna ask about you as an individual, because no one cares. What do you think as the hive mind that is chat makes you likable? That's a good question. As a hive mind, not individual. Comedic timing. Our butt, comedy. Big dick energy. We give you money. That's the top one answer. And the top one answer is the money. I have to figure out the Cyprus shit. Diversity? Diversity. I don't think there's a lot of Chinese, Brazilian, black people in this chat. This is probably 90% white people. 95 maybe. We're as diverse as an American movie from the 1980s, dude. Okay, like, give me that. Give me that. University. You're Jewish? Well, that's white. Do you see chat as one organism or as a group of people? I see chat... Do you want to know how I see chat? Like, all jokes aside. I see chat as... I see you guys as a big organic blob. This is chat, okay? Uh, let me explain, let me explain, let me explain. This is how I see you guys. And this blob has tentacles. Once in a while, there's a tentacle of someone, someone, someone interesting. This is a tentacle where some viewers, not many, leave the mass and they're like intelligent. They're, they're interesting. They actually have something to say. There's a tentacle of mass retardation, like people that are just completely mentally ill and stupid. The, uh, there's a tentacle of people that think they're funny, but they always make the same jokes. That's how I see chat. You guys are a blob with little tentacles. And I, I like to pay attention to the tentacles, you know, like this tentacle makes me mad. This tentacle, I like these guys. That's how I see chat. Okay, here we go. I need to probably push them to zero and then something happens. Unification progress is zero. Mm -hmm. What tentacle am I, Tommy? Oh, you know which one you are, Red Billy. You know which one you are. You just drew a virus? <laughs> Did you just call me a testicle? <laughs> okay. Pay each other two compliments. One focusing on the mind, the other on appearance. Okay, I'm gonna make this about you and me, chat. Chat has to give a compliment to Tommy, and Tommy has to give a compliment to Chat. Oh. Uh... Good beard, thank you. Okay, massive balls. Like your beard. It's all about your beard. Everybody says beard. That's all you got about me? Something nice about Chat. Uh... 
very loyal like you guys uh, there's some people in chat that will watch anything i do and i think that's insane that blows my mind like they support me no matter what that's crazy to me why would you do that turkish citizens join extremist groups fuck um even though like a, a small portion is loyal a lot of you will forget me in a second if i would get banned um dude something positive about chat uh <laughs> You're not a fake ass streamer who does everything to get bucks. Thank you, man. Uh, I have nothing positive about you guys. And you guys are not funny. Like, one tentacle is funny. Thank you, Mezzo Murat. Uh, positive about chat. I have one positive thing about chat. You guys are geniuses because you chose to watch me. Today, you clicked on me. You're watching this channel. Expect all these other boring ass channels, man. That uh, That is genius. You're very clever with that stuff. I, wow. I tip my head there. Very, very good. How about we're loyal? How about you're retarded? I said that 10 seconds ago, you monkey. Danny's tie attack. Oh, fucking terrorism. Okay, next question. If you could magically invent a drug that could put you in any sort of mood, what would that be? Happy, yeah, happy, not depressed. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that just chocolate? High energy 24-7? High energy, though, when it wears off, you probably get fucked, man. Focus, that's good. Oh, that's a great answer. Israel is Western, and they took Gaza. That's a very good answer. Focused. A drug that makes you focused on a task, like studying. That's, that's good. Or like a drug that makes you remember stuff more when you study. That's good. That's good. Learning abilities. That's a great answer. Having no emotions whatsoever. That's dark. Jesus. That's called Xanax. Maybe one that doesn't kill rappers. Dude, these terrorist attacks are getting ultra annoying. Alhamdulillah. Getting two mils and I don't know what to do with them. Like, legit. Well, I need to build... These bad boys. I actually need to build these bad boys here. Three mils are coming in, right? Thank you, Patchface, man. Two mils coming in. Good. And university, finally, man. I have so much money, man. I don't even know what to do with the money. I have way too much money. I need to start investing again. Suddenly, they are rejecting. Weird. The Hezbollah is changing their views. Lots of investments, so when I kill them later, they are very fruitful. Clever, clever. Investy, investy, investy. Oh, they always ask for debt bailout, which gives me massive influence. This ah, I should invest in people more, because they actually give me mad money. Iraq actually takes my investments. No, they only took one. Dude, these terrorist attacks are getting actually ultra annoying, to be honest. They are annoying the fuck out of me right now. Where's terrorism again? F make films about PKK murders. What? The fuck? Oh, I forgot my industrialization program. Oh, fuck me. In 185 days, guys, you have to totally tell me. Oh, there's so much stuff I'm not clicking, man. Where's the terrorism? You have to pay way too much attention to this mod. Fuck off. Here, terrorism. Boom, boom, boom. One campaign about terrorists. I totally forgot the industrial build-up, man. Fuck. So, and these are thing for now. Yes, it's amazing. 185 days, guys. Please tell me in 185 days. Hafez al-Assad insulted my nation. Dude, Syria really wants to get shit on. Oh, they have Iran on their side. Oh, we have interesting stuff gonna happen soon, huh? Okay. I'm gonna buy some factories after this, and the industry of Turkey is finally going somewhere. Okay, name five. Shut up, weed sucks. What do you think are your best qualities? Chat, what do you think is the best qualities of chat? Dude, there will only be meme answers. What could possibly... Come on. What do you think is the best qualities of chat? Or maybe even on average, every Twitch chat, on every channel. What is good qualities of a Twitch chat? Juice? Saves you from boredom. True, that's a very good answer. 
Streaming would be fucking trash without the chat. Okay, I'm actually... This is my first research that can actually put in something that matters. And that's gonna obviously be the start of... Airplanes, man. Early fighter designs. That's my first real research, man. In, in, in six years. Almost seven. <laughs> Money. Loyalty. We support each other in times of need. That's a very, very deep answer. Because in the end, the, the the relationship between a streamer and his chat is... You don't make... I help you to not feel alone, and you help me not feel alone. I think that's the biggest thing between a streamer and his chat. We help each other not feeling alone. You listen to me in the back to not feel alone. I play games with you guys, so I don't feel alone in my room. That's a uh, calm demeanor. Yeah, sure, Alton. Natürlich, eh. Chat is so calm, right? <clears throat> that is actually a very good answer. I, dude, I actually have so much money, I can just buy equipment. Actually, I have so much money, I could just buy equipment real quick. Let me do that. I totally... I, I always ask myself, what the fuck is money for in this game? But, well, here you fucking go. That's what money is for. Turkish army is buying the whole market of... Vehicles, man. I just bought every vehicle in the world. That's a big, big project. I have the money, though. This actually shows what money should be used for. Okay, Gene, dude, here we go. I can finally reach the stuff I care about. So, basic air is gonna be, uh, once again, just uh, fighters with drones. I just like that. And we're getting the uh, Bayraktar TB2 drone, man. Imagine 2.6k people watching you, but completely empty chat. Wouldn't that be extremely creepy? That would be very creepy. That would be like being Shenry. Uh, that would be like, you know. <clears throat> anyway, next question. What is your most irritating work colleague like? Uh, Red Willy. Red Willy. Papa Guenia joins the SEO. What character traits do you long to find in someone else? It would help you feel that you discovered a soulmate. Name a character trait a person needs to have that makes you feel like you, you met your soulmate. That's very easy for me. That's humor. Humor. There, there's always honest people, sexy people, good blowjob people. But, but understanding humor. Like imagine you make one of your weird jokes and the partner, the girl, whatever, doesn't get the joke. That's a problem. Here we go, university, man. Nice. University is going to work on... Oh, I have so much to work on, man. I, w I said I want to work on helicopters. I said I want to make some helicopters this, this game. I, I Sharing my depression. I think humor. Like, getting the jokes, you know? Like, I remember when I was texting girls on Tinder in a hum humoristic way, and they would just not get the joke. Oh, I don't even have good guns. I need the HK-33. Finally actually researching good stuff. Thank you, Robocop, man. Thank you very much. Humor, humor, man. Yeah. What would you have been like if I'd met you 10 years ago? What have you learned since then? <clears throat> well, most of chat will be fucking two years old 10 years ago. So you would just be a baby. Hmm. By the way, I need to do the anti-Cypress shit. Huh. Well, 10 years ago, I would just be... Let's, let's do the question... How will Tommy be like if he started streaming with 20 years? I will be just ultra cringe. I will do massive mistakes. I will get banned a lot. I will be too edgy. I will attract a weird crowd. I will just be an edgy teen, man. Easy, easy, easy. I'd be actually nine years old. <laughs> yeah, you guys will be kids. <clears throat> I wasn't even there 10 years ago. <laughs> if you met me when I was 12, could you imagine? You probably were more intelligent back then than now. Uh, can you make a pool to show how old Chad is? Uh, we do that all the time. Don't want to do that right now. Too bored. Average age is 18 to 22. Something like that. <clears throat> kind of crazy that some of you guys grew up with me. Like, imagine you watch someone like Lyric, right? For 10 years. You literally grew up with him. You watch Lyric when you're 12 and you still know him when you're 22. You literally grew up with content creators. Like, when I sometimes watch PewDiePie, which I don't do anymore, I always felt like I see this, I've seen this guy's life. Because I watched him for so many years. Kind of interesting, man, how you see people grow up on the internet. 23 gang. If you're 23 in this channel, you're already an old fuck, man. Okay, I, I, if I, uh, one more click and I made the Turkish separate approval rating a zero, which could be something good, I guess. I don't know. Dude, I'm gonna lose so much money in a second for all the vehicles I bought. 10 years ago, edgy stuff was still somewhat tolerated. Remember PewDiePie edgy arc? I don't even feel like he was that edgy, man. 
I saw you going from monkey ghetto ginger to a sex will soon to be fodder. Fuck you. It's very weird, man. Very weird. Very weird. Sometimes I look at Lisa and she's pregnant. I'm like, bro, there's going to be fucking kids soon in my arms. Fucking weird. But that's real life. What you going to do? What you going to do? What would you like to do better than your parents? Well... Oh, that's deep, man. First of all, less alcohol. Looking at my dad, I my kid will never see me drink, never see me drunk. I never see me drunk. Maybe on a party or a wedding, but there won't be a drunk dad. Not happening. Um, and talking more about emotions. I, I love my parents. My parents have been great, but they never had a, a big set of emotions from their parents. Uh, talking more about stuff, being more open about this stuff. Teaching the kid that they can talk to you, man. You know, not swallowing everything and always staying quiet about shit. Remember the industrial... It's 185 days. Is it already happening? You're just faking you see me, aren't you? Sent a mission to... Somalia. I don't need that right now. No, no, no. 80 days. 80 days. You fake news me. 80 days, dude. Oh, you can see how good the Lira is. The Lira is doing pretty good here, man, to be honest. Oh, you can see uh, the value of the Lira. That's pretty insane, dude. That's really insane. Chad, what would you do different than your parents? I want to hear about you guys a bit. You can leave Sifs, though. I will, I will. Not leaving my family and my child. Bruh, to real, man. Jesus Christ, emotions are running high, boy. God damn it. Yeah, these industrial complexes, you're totally right, man. I want to finish the Cyprus event. Dude, I'm buying so many equipments. Not that much for you, they're great. That's good, man, if you can say that. Teach more. I think a good answer is um, more sports. A lot of parents don't do a lot of sports with their children. That's a good answer. I won't go out buying cigarettes. <laughs> My mother doesn't speak to me. What the fuck, man? Jeez. This is getting way too real right now. Better relationship. Damn. Too real. Let's go next question. Too real, man. Chat is getting too real here, bro. Okay, I'm getting... I actually finished this. The rest is a bit stupid. And then we're going to the main tree. In what ways are you slightly mad? Bearing in mind that everyone is slightly mad. Normie question. In what ways are you slightly mad? I can easily answer that for myself real quick. If I... And it got better over the years. But if I genuinely have an issue with you, like I genuinely hate you, I will complete Magic the Gathering. I will completely put everything I have against you. You saw it, for example, with the Hacker Cut Sean. If I pick you out as my enemy, which doesn't happen nowadays anymore, later, I will put everything I am as a being into fighting you, man. I will ignore my own life and just go after you. That's very, very toxic behavior. Very mad. Very mad. Very, very mad. I get a little mad when I can see no progress. Hmm. Declared a Turkish dictatorship. 15 PP coming in. And the unity committee is the undisputed ruling party. On that note, what happened to that Estonia cringe old kid? No, no, let's not talk about it. It's the past. I hope Tommy makes me his enemy and just follows me 24-7. What is your biggest pet peeve unrelated to your streaming career? What does pet peeve mean? What is a pet peeve? Kuwait, Kuwait Oil Company had an IPO. Initial public offering. What is a pet peeve? What is that? <coughs> pet peeve. Is that kinky shit with your mom or? A small annoyance. What's... Oh, what? what's... Something annoying about me. Oh, Russia attacks my influence in Upper Kanzi. Terrorists killed. Something annoying about me. ADHD. I pay no attention a lot. Like if I meet you and you're like, Hey man, what's up? Add a better outpost one. I'm adding an outpost. I don't understand this at all. There's a chance of me producing missiles. What? I'm strengthening an outpost. I don't know what that means. I don't even understand. I want to finish Cyprus. Um, I have ADHD. Like, it's hard to get my attention. Uh, I'm tired quickly. Like, if you party with me, I will go home very early because I want to go to bed. I fought a lot. If you're around me, I'm going to be smelling a lot from my ass. Um, I might have bad breath sometimes because I have stomach issues. 
Yeah, if you meet me RL, there's a chance I might have bad breath, which sucks, man. I want to figure that out, but it's because of my stomach issues. Thank you, Gian. Yeah, self-roast session. Self-roast session. <sighs> hmm. But what annoys you and others? What annoys you and others? I hate humans that are super arrogant about themselves. For example, I see this a lot lately with real estate agents. They're like, hello, sir. What, you, you, wear, you wear these pants? I can't take you serious. You see my car? It's my BMW. <laughs> Look at me, man. <laughs> Can you really afford this, man? Like this shit of like, oh, I don't wanna oh, go away, man. You complete fucking empty soul, dude. Yeah, and obviously people annoy me that are like like assholes that, you know, if, if you like don't wear your mask indoors, even though everybody else is doing it, I think that's a bit like, fuck you. You're not a rebel, you're just a cunt. There's some good real estate agents. Today I was on the phone with a really good real estate agent. Oh, little story about a real estate agent. Today I got a call from a real estate agent and she said, Mr. K, you got the apartment. And me and Lisa were sitting there like, Okay, and she's like, oh, you're not, you're not happy. What's going on? Don't you want to buy it? I, I, I told the guy you want to buy it. You have an exclusivity contract. And me and Lisa were like, we kind of hope to not get it. And, uh, and now we have one week. And it's just this weird thing where for the first time ever in our lives, an apartment, a very good apartment, it's very sexy, has uh, accepted us, right? And for some reason, me and Lisa just don't feel it. Maybe the older people in chat that moved out before, when you move out to a new apartment, you have to have that, that click. You have to have that that moment you need to have that thing that you feel it and we don't have that there so it's a bit sad this real estate agent is very nice she's a good girl uh does a good job and i have to text her probably on friday and tell her i'm so sorry that you gave us the go and and that you kept it for us but it's such a big investment this is the biggest investment of my entire life five hundred thousand fucking dollars man uh and for some reason we just don't feel it i'm sorry that we said we wanted it because we actually told her we want to get it it's a bit unfair to her but that's just life it's real life there's so much money involved you can't have any emotions there with over 500 000 fucking euros involved there's no room for emotions man zero i would like to get the manpad 2005 let's do that you just can't have that there next question Complete this sentence. When someone frustrates me, I tend to... I just get very angry and, and want to fight. I just want to fight. When someone frustrates you, Shad, what do you do? You just uh, turn off the internet? The Cobra helicopter. I'm actually doing helicopters for once. I've been yelled at by Entitled Dad because we didn't have a product. Yeah, that's just... Turkish dictatorship, man. Control the press. Gives me massive power, man. Let's start controlling the press. I'm literally building military dictatorship. When I'm angry, I masturbate. If it's RL, I can become passive aggressive. Do the investment into the country? First of all, I wait. It went up. It went back to thirty. I, I do wait. What it was at five? Oh, here. Thank you for the investment. Thank you. One sif. Thank you for telling me. Very important. Why did that thing go back up to thirty? Like what? It was five. I don't fucking get this at all, man. I don't understand this for a second. Online, I just ignore. Yeah, online, just ignore, right? When you're young, you you remember when you were a kid and YouTube was weird and, and, and new and you would always go into the comment section on YouTube and argue with people when you were younger? Like nowadays, right? Who fuck cares anymore? Back in my day, 10 years ago, you would argue so much on YouTube, man. Your opinion sucks, man. Fuck you, man. You can't even grammar, man. Fuck you, dude. You still do that? Jeez. Wait, it turned blue. Wait, it went up to 50. Yo, what? The fuck is happening? I have no idea what's happening here. Genuinely, no clue. It just went up to 50? Anyway, what are you selfish about? Food, easy. If I go to a restaurant and I order some fucking really good shit, don't touch my shit, man. Buy your own shit, eat your plate, and fuck off. You, I can marry you, huh? Don't touch my shit. I, I share with Lisa. She's the only one. But don't touch fucking food, man, that I ordered. It's gonna suck when I have a kid, man. He will always fucking want my food. Oh, fuck, dude. Daddy, can I have the last shrimp? Man, fuck you can. Fuck you. This is a hard world. You ain't getting no shrimp. I share food, but I don't like doing it. Get your own. Oh, a Haka. There we go. We're getting some. We're finally updating the guns, man. I still have this. 
I have a what? I have a gun from 1975, bro. <laughs> Let's fix that, man. Uh, the shipments of cars should be coming soon, shouldn't it? Yeah. No, it it came. Hey, I didn't lose that. I didn't lose any money. They're still coming, but I didn't lose any money. Let's start buying infantry stuff. I'm buying a lot of guns. I'm buying CC equipment, and I'm buying some man pads. I need to use my money. I have way too much money. I don't know what to do with it. I'm starting to feel a little bit broken. I'm starting to feel like I'm getting too strong here. Because I can just do what I want with this money. Now you say that, but wait when you see the baby size. Yeah. Sometimes I get a prawn. There you go, Lisa. Theoretic scenes as the regime in Ukraine changes again. Still nationalist. Ukraine and Russia are friends here in this game. My little sister was so absorbing. Her mother sometimes couldn't eat at the table because she ate. What are you selfish about, chat? What are you selfish about? What are you selfish about? Investment from France. Industry is actually slowly growing. I'm a big fan. I still don't understand the Cyprus stuff for a second, man. I'm not even going to act like I understand that Cyprus shit. Like, what is that, man? Dude, it, it went up from 0 to 100 in one month. I don't get this shit. The moment I went to 0... I, I don't understand this. I'm not even going to try. No idea. A hundred. I, I, I'm gonna stop doing this. I Nothing here makes any sense to me. I spent so much political power on the Cyprus dispute and I have no idea what the fuck happened here. Zero clue what the fuck this is. My PC? Yeah, PC. You have to be selfish about a PC. Yeah. When, when someone goes at your PC, that's... Uh, right? That's... Uh, that's... Uh, it's my baby. Don't touch that. My own time and personal space. Yeah, that, that's... Everybody would say that, I guess. Yeah, I'm wearing shoes in my house. The fuck? Is there anyone yet that can, that can explain? Oh, okay. Uh, now the unification progress starts. <sighs> Greeks are hitting you back, Alta. Dude, the Greeks just went from zero to one hundred percent in one month. How is that humanly possible? That's insane. It makes no sense. It's working. It's going up. But I don't want this to happen. Because it's bad for me. I'm just going to evade them later. Dude, you know what? You know what? Fuck it. I'm turning that off. I'm turning that off. Fuck off. Build a stronger outpost. Okay, I'm building outposts against terrorists. That seems important, I think. And then I can start attacking the PKK. Man, this is such a confusing mod. But it's confusing in a good way. I like how confusing it is. Industrial complex lease and nationalist propaganda. The military is your friend. Believe in us, bitch. Next question. Sketch the course of three previous relationships you had. Oh, shit. No, we shouldn't do that. Control the press. Nice. That's good. End of Turkish democracy. Getting massive bonuses here. My stability is ultra low, though. Jesus Christ. I, I'm not... I want to do that one. No, we're going to skip that. I talked about that stuff. By the way, I get stability here. I always forget to press these buttons. I like this mod in the way that a player that always checks his events is better than a player that doesn't. I'm ignoring a lot of stuff here, which makes me weaker. I, I like that. I think that's cool. I think that's cool. Describe your ideal relationship. I also, this is date questions. You shouldn't talk about past relationships on dates. That's really weird. Third general Z scanning. Cooled IR systems. I just want the 2005 manpad. Describe your ideal relationship dynamic and the roles you and your partner will take. Whoa. It even says hard question. I didn't know they have difficulties. Describe your ideal relationship dynamic and the roles you and your partner will take. First of all, I want to say, and that's, I just want to be honest. This is not sexist or anything. It's just a decision that I made as a human being. It will bother me if my partner would be more successful than me. It's just the truth. I think in real life, like with a great partner as Lisa, I would handle it. Like if Lisa would all of a sudden make far more money than me or something, I would handle it because I, I love that girl to death till the day I die, you know, that's my partner. But like in a basic relationship, it would be a problem for me. It's just... It's just the truth, man. I'm not going to sit you like some cuck and just lie. I, I would have problems with that because I'm competitive, I guess. So I don't know, man. I don't know. It's just honest, dude. Just honest. Maybe an ego thing? Yeah. Yeah, it's just honest. You know? 
but the ideal relationship dynamic and the rules she would like to take and here's another sexist thing <laughs> i'm gonna say i like uh, it's not like this in real life jeremy corbin one it's not like that in real life lisa can totally fend for herself but averagely speaking i don't mind being in the provider role i like i like that i it's just truthful man i'm sorry it's just industrial projects sif building suite 25 I, I i wouldn't mind being the provider of the family it's i like that actually it makes me a bit proud and stuff it's obviously a little bit um it's obviously a little bit old age but you know why would that be sexist? Well, some left-wing crazy person would think that's sexist. It's just the way I see things. But saying all that stuff, I'm still very open-minded, right? Like, dude, it's just a basic opinion. But even if it doesn't go that way, then I'm still okay. I want to make films about PKK murders. I never said I would. I never thought I would say that in the stream. I'm gonna abandon Cyprus. I don't get that stuff in a second. Stop mansplaining. You know. And the best dynamic in a relationship, which I, for example, have with Lisa, is just is just communication and honesty. Don't have any dumbass secrets, man, right? Just say it as it is. If they leave you after that, then it's not a good relationship anyway. And just communicate, talk about stuff. Don't just feed stuff into yourself. If you have a problem, fucking talk about it, dude. And that's how good relationships are made. Took me some time to realize that. What is your view on having a family? Well, the greatest thing ever, I want to have one. I was very scared my whole life that I that I can't have children. If, dude, I genuinely believe, if a doctor would have told me I can't have children, that would have hit me harder than saying I have cancer. Oh, here, unite the people, temper sensibility, very very important. I I always was scared I couldn't make a family because I think I'm a big family guy. I I cannot wait to have a family. I can't wait for the dynamics of raising a child and interacting with them. I think that's so exciting. Um, very excited for that shit. Can I be 13 to watch the stream? Uh, I don't know, can you? That talk is that thought is said, Tommy. What if doctor said you had testicle cancer? What do you think you why did you think you couldn't have children? I, I didn't know. No one knows if they can have children until it happens. You never know. Also, in my youth, I got a lot of uh footballs in my ball sack, man. A lot, man. A lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. A lot of balls getting fucked over i kind of don't want to do investments anymore because i'm so rich anyway i'm starting to feel a little bit broken with money let's keep going i don't want to play it lazy investing in the boys i need to get a glass of water invest 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 iraq iran doesn't want my money huh they do actually oh yeah Iran, huh? Even you're selling out to the Turks. Look at that. Investy, investy, and 15 investments. Playing good here. Lower your taxes. I, I don't ever have PP for that. I need, I'm need. i busy right now making films about PKK murders. Anyway, next question. Isn't that fun, guys? What, what would you love a kind person to come away... What? What would you love a kind person to come away thinking about you after you met them for the first time? That is not English, man. What? What would you like? Let's say you have a date with someone. What would you like that person to think about you after the date? That was not English, man. What would you like a person to think about you after the date? Well, big dick. Big dick. But I'm, I'm having a lot of influence in this region now. Big dick that I'm God, that I'm sexy, that I'm funny. Well, that you're dateable is obviously the top one answer, you know. 185 days have passed. I just clicked it. I just clicked it, man. Fake news, fake news. Actually, not not fake news. I deeply apologize to you. Baba ye to the best too. Sorry. Critical positions first. That's important. But I first want to make the PKK movies. <clears throat> okay. Just generally interested in me. Husband material. Yeah, that's good. I wouldn't care. <laughs> what are the main points you would like to be covered in your funeral speech in? Oh, that's deep. What do you want your funeral speech to be about? I'm a guy that always imagined funerals in his life a lot. In a weird way, this is very deep shit. In a weird way, my entire life is based on the thought 
that I want like this sounds weird in my entire life I always wanted that a lot of people cry when I die like I want when my funeral is people are literally sad that I died that's kind of like my, my life goal in a weird way let's get the MP here but that's not weird right everybody has that that's awful what I feel like that shows it I've been to a lot of funerals in my life uh, thank you Yazoo for the five gifted man thank you very very much hunt down terrorists gives more approval rating and part popularity decreases pickup up power by 10 and max power by 5 if they are still around if they are still around what do you mean I didn't attack them once man uh, I was at a lot of funerals and in a weird way what I felt is that a funeral shows you what you achieved in your life if you have a funeral and no one is there oh my god Taiwan Strait Crisis, China has fired artillery. Oy, oy, oy. Uh, I want to just talk. Uh, let's go speed forward for a second. I want to talk about this. If you will, kinda is the ending screen of a video game. You know, when you finish a game, oh, you found this many achievements, blah, blah, blah. I always felt a little bit that a funeral shows your life achievements. Because if no one comes and no one cries, then hmm, huh, what happened, man? But if you have a lot of people coming and they all talk good about you and a lot of people cry, that kind of, to me, means you, you, you had a good life and you influenced a lot of people positively. Yeah. 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 Your entire life is to gather people for your funeral. Yeah, in a way. You know? I also want my funeral to have a kahoot about my life and the winner gets the money. <laughs> I didn't understand. I thought kahoot is the but it's actually a quiz about you. I had I needed a second to understand that shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's genius. Imagine you do a quiz about your life and whoever has most answers gets all your money. That's that's so Jewish, Shekel. That's so Jewish of you, bro. <laughs> that's that's a very good idea, bro. I'm thinking of a kazoo. Okay, I'm getting Apache helicopters, man. Let's go, baby. With playfulness and generosity, point out to one another how you feel the other might be difficult to live alongside. If Chet was a girl, what would be difficult to live with you? That you're mentally retarded? Um, that you will trigger me all the time? Like, you, you will always try to trigger me? Like, I will come home, you will already be like, Huh, Baldy? What's up, you fat cunt? You will always dead that. You will be very naggy, yeah. Constantly talking shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Probably not washing much. No hygiene. That you never wear pants, Tommy. <laughs> Tourette syndrome. Most toxic relationship ever. It will be very toxic. It will be very toxic, man. Always changing opinions about everything. Wait, me? What? What do you mean? I have to actually get some water, man. I'm dehydrating. But let's do one more question. Then I have to get some water. It's already 2007. I didn't do shit yet. Which I like. I like that. What changes in some aspects of your life are currently contemplating... Wait, wait. What changes that happened in your life are you daydreaming about? But I always daydream that I'm not in the supermarket anymore, right? That I'm not in the ghetto shit anymore. Easy. What are you daydreaming about that changed in your life lately, chat? Okay, here comes the man, Pat 2005. What are you giving you terrible advice? Hey, girl, I feel a bit sick. Oh, Tommy, I think you have fucking cancer. Go to the doctor, you piece of shit. Subbing to Tommy K. Thank you, Erda Monar. Wishing I had a big dick. Being an orf, uh, author. Any advice for young men and teens? Just watch my stream every day. You're going to be fine. Getting the fuck out of university, people wish. Getting sexy. I quit my job. Nothing. I don't daydream. I daydream a shit ton, man. You don't daydream? I dream so much every day. Hunting down terrorism. I still don't understand how that... Oh, the threat actually went down by five. That's the first time that ever happened. I actually made it go down by five. First time ever. We're actually destroying terrorism. You finishing the mega campaign. Piece of shit. Making it as a porn star. <laughs> okay, let me make the PKK movies and then... Actually, I said... Okay, I'm gonna take a little break. I'm gonna pee real quick and get some water. I'm a bit dehydrated. One second. One second. Pizza? Is it? Ah, okay, start with the banner.
man. Days are running by fast lately. Me and Lisa said that the other day. Right now is the phase in my life after 30 years where I feel like the time is running the fastest. But I feel like you always feel that when you're older. Like every day feels like five hours to me. A referendum for the people. Tell Dirk to elect the president of the people. The result of the referendum was yes, the president will no longer be elected by parliament. Ah, strikes in the Turkish telecom. And terrorist attacks. Where's the difference? And I'm making movies about PKK murders. What does it actually do? You get war support. And I get more political power. Okay. I dream about winning the Euro jackpot so I can pay Tommy for proper maternity leave. I think I think it's very unhealthy to think about financial success. I think that's unhealthy. Because you dream about something that's unlikely to ever happen. And I think that's not healthy. You know, I always dreamt of like, what if I win a poker tournament? But that just keeps you that just keeps you down and behind because it's so unrealistic. Right? 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 Okay, next I need to make uh critical positions against the Kurds. What are you excessively anxious about? Anxious. Anxious. Anxious is like being nervous in a social situation, right? Anxious. Feeling or showing very nervous nervosity. Very easy answer for introverts. Making calls and, and talking to people and stuff, you know? Like, I have to tell a real estate agent that I'm not taking an apartment. That makes me a bit... Ugh, that makes me feel weird. Arrest the Democrats in Turkey. Let's go. Yeah, making a phone call and stuff. Finding a new job, going to job interviews. Yeah, that's fucking ugh. Cyprus? I abandoned Cyprus. It's, the system is too dumb for me. <clears throat> you on your peak now as someone in the 30s now and you have a lot of pressure coming with that age. What's the most useless option for uh, multiplayer? <laughs> Good answer. <laughs> um, uh, okay. They dream of coming back on Twitch. That's not that far away. As like winning the lottery what songs would you want at your funeral that's a good question i have no idea lisa huh? if i die right now and you have to organize my funeral which song would you choose that's a ooh, that's a big question that is big oh that's so sad this is uh you know every relationship with a girl has a song and this is uh, my lisa's song this is mine and Lisa's song. Oh, that's so sad. Yeah. Oh, that's so sad. Imagine they put my fucking coffin down and this fucking shit runs. This is mine and Lisa's song, man. Sand outro? That's a song about the girl leaving you. What the fuck? The song is so sad, bro. It's actually a song where he talks like he died. Oh my god. Hava Nagila. Yeah, check it out. Magical Clouds downtown. Don't want to spam me with it. My way, Frank Sinatra. That's way too fucking basic, man. What are you, Donald Trump? What kind of people do you like as friends, but not as lovers? And vice versa. Hmm. What people do you like as friends, but not as lovers? Ugly people? Right? If you're ugly, I want to be friends with you, but not. I don't want to fuck you. And uh, what kind of people do you like as friends, but not as lovers? Hmm. Well, ugly people. Startup company and acquisition. I will buy them. I have money like a crazy person. Um, I guess. And what kind of people would you like as lovers and not as friends? Well, sexual people, you know, I guess. Hmm, I don't know. What would you like as a friend, but not as a lover? People that talk too much. You know, people that talk way too much, you know, they can be your friends, sure. Like, once a month you listen to their bullshit, but every day? Uh, good thing Lisa knows when she's allowed to talk. What moves you to tears? Animal stuff. Easy, man. When, when animals get hurt. Like, I almost cried. I didn't cry in fucking years, man. Because I'm toxic masculine. When I was watching my octopus teacher, man, dude, that shit made me... When that thing happened in the end, I'm not gonna spoil it. What a fucking movie that is. That wow, that almost got me, dude. Sad animal stuff is is bad, dude. <clears throat> Where's the music, man? Jesus. 
I want to uh, build better positions against the Kurdish here with 50 PP. I cry often because it happens when I laugh. What? Tell me, can you destroy Armenia in this campaign? Um, shut up. Chopper backstory. Chopper backstory. I don't understand that. Saving Private Ryan makes me cry? That doesn't make me cry. It makes me more like shocked. Like the scene with the knife is so shocking. It makes me not cry though. I'm Legend with the Dog makes you sad. One Piece Chopper. Chopper's backstory. <laughs> Like, I know what the fuck you're talking about. What are your parents' strong points and their weaknesses? I don't want to talk about that. We're skipping that one. We did that before. What character traits would you like to be forgiven for? Competitiveness. 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 That I always want to be better than others. Which could come across as toxic, but I like that. I like that trait, because it makes you fight for progress. In a way, you know? Okay, critical positions against PKK, and I'm getting the F16 Falcon now. A Crichton Optimus Prime died. Wait, he dies? Bayaraktar! Bayaraktar! Bayar, Baya, 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 Bayaraktar! Bayaraktar! I have no mills. I cried at the end of last Samurai. Dude, everybody cried at Gladiator, right? Gladiator, man, that shit made you. They made. It. That's where men cried, dude. Okay, I arrest all the Democrats, and I now uh, I'm completely stepping away from the European Union, which gives me massive political power, which I need. I need PP in this build. UK leaves EU, and Turkey also doesn't care about you anymore. Thank you, Lenin, my dude. Gladiator was so sad, dude. You cried at Interstellar? Why? What's sad about Interstellar? Forrest Gump is depressing in a way, yeah. Forrest Gump is just about a bitch abusing a mentally ill person. Um, describe your favorite childhood toy. One of my favorite toys ever is obviously... Oh, I don't know where it is. Well, my Game Boy Color. In my, in my generation, Game Boy Color was insane. But obviously, Lego is probably the top answer. Lego man, you, the, the stuff you could do with Lego, you could, if you're a creative kid, you could do so many stories with, with Legos. Legos were insane. That, that was the most insane stuff, dude. I cried with Arrival. 2008 Turkish Recession, it's only 2008. Oh, the stock market, Lehman Brothers is bankrupt. The two, Battle with Al-Qaeda started. Oh my god. And I'm in a recession. <sighs> The 2008 housing market crash. Actually, this is very fast, this game. We only played eight years in just one stream, kind of. That's insane. Well, fucking Americans killing the world economy. The Americanskis, I'm telling you. Prepare for airstrikes. Let me do the critical position first. I want to really fuck up the terrorists now. Right now is when you buy all the stocks and then in 10 years you're rich as fuck. True. True, true. What attitudes to food do you find appealing in a partner? Well, easy. Me and Lisa, caring about food. I could never date a person that just eats food and doesn't care about it. Like, Feedback Gaming does that. Feedback Gaming. You could go with him to the best restaurant in the world, right? 50 people died making this dish. He will just be like, oh, that's fancy. That's fancy. Oh, nice. He also, nice. He also inhales it. Yeah, he just... Oh. Do, 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 do. You could give him a $5,000 fish. He will just... Do, do, do. Oh, nice. Uh, fuck that shit. Could never date a person like this. Unbelievable. Oh, we got a new gun. We got a new gun, baby. My guns have massively upgraded here. Turkish uh, industry is getting somewhere now, man. Reconnaissance tanks are important. I need to really... Economy is a joke here for... For... Um, you could never date Dave the top rank. What's your favorite Disney Pixar movie? Um, Wally. -E. Wally. -E. Wally -E is too good. Wally -E is one of the best movies ever. What is 10 things you want to do before you die? You have a, like a bucket list. I don't have a bucket list. I don't ever did that. I really, I want to raise a family. I want to be part of a functioning family. I'm interested in that. I want to be a millionaire. Uh, that's something I plan. And again, I just want to always be honest with you guys. I'm not going to further improvements. Here we go. I'm not going to lie to you. One of my life goals is to be a millionaire. Whoa, but I swear to God, I please it. believe me when I say I that. Opinion one day. I play it every day. It's amazing. Um, thank you for stopping. Uh, I want to be a millionaire, not because, ooh, fancy and ooh, look at my money, look at my suit, look at my car. I swear to God, it's not that. It's just to prove me something. 
I just want to die one day. I want to leave this planet knowing that I made it from the ghetto to a millionaire. I just want that ego trip. I just want to know that I did that. I get global interventionalism. That's really, really good. Very, very good. I swear to God to you, please believe me. I don't want to be a millionaire for, for, for gains and stuff. It's just to prove a point in a way. Eat in a Michelin star restaurant. Yes, yes. And uh, one thing on my bucket list, I want to one day release a manga. That is, I talked about this very often. Check out the YouTube channel about it, uh, the YouTube video about it. I want to release a manga one day. That's generally something I give a shit about. Jesus Christ, sounds all very weird. Just live in Russia and you're millionaire. <laughs> okay, the uh, terrorist threat is actually going down a bit. <clears throat> What do people seldom properly understand about you? I don't understand this English. What do people seldom properly understand about you? Seldom properly? I don't understand. What do people never understand about you? In a way. What? Yeah. What do people not understand about me? I think some people younger in this channel don't understand that I am obviously an exaggerated, exaggerated version of myself on the stream. Like, I'm not that fucking retarded in real life and mad all the time. If you meet me in real life, I'm a 200% calmer version of this right now. I think people don't understand that sometimes. Especially, oh, pressure to close pro PKK TV networks on European countries. Okay, fucking with the PKK. Um, like at conventions, you, sometimes you guys come up to me and you're really meme and weird. I'm like, dude, we're just two adults. Can you just talk normal, man? What's up? I guess that. And. You know. And that I'm actually not balding that badly. You guys don't ever, ever understand that. I'm not balding that badly. Thank you, Drument. Right? Like, right here is still everything okay. I don't know what you talk about. If you can't look on top of me, you don't even see I'm balding. Nope, nope, nope. Actually, 2008 already. That's but we still have many years to play, and we're just gonna run. Focus this, focus this, focus this. Stabilization act for stability. Talking about stability, there is the stabilizing stuff in the bottom. Yeah, stabilize secretarian vows. Get that stability up, baby. Good. Bold spot in the respect of God. I got the man pads. We're actually growing, man. I'm getting artillery. The Turkish army is finally reforming. It took literally eight years to reform this country, man. Jesus Christ. What type of traveling companion would you like as an ideal partner? Like a fearless one, someone that wants to wake up early, a lot of culture, a lot of laziness. Hmm. Easy again. I, dude, this shows Lisa is the woman of my life because all of these questions, the answer is Lisa. I want a partner like. Oh, I thank you, Dwalok, man. Thank you, man. Thanks for great entertainment. All the best to you three. Any tips against the hamster? Tips against weaning hamster weaning feeling. feeling. Uh, jump out of your comfort zone and do stuff that's new to you. Like I don't know, working out, join a club, join join a sports club, uh, something like this. Um, well, Lisa. Um, some culture, some low-level hiking, and lots of food. Reviewing a lot of food. That's my favorite travel companion. What is your favorite travel companion? But probably your parents, because a lot of you guys are like 15. Someone entertaining. I, I once dated a girl. I was in Paris with her. She was the worst, man. 5 a.m. in the morning, the fucking phone will... Dee -dee 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 Tommy, wake up! Tommy, wake up! We have a full day, and then all day long, just we have to be there, and then six, we have to be there, and then we have to be... Fuck that bitch! Never again! Oh my god, that was not worth it. Consumer spent less. I'm getting a depression? Oh my god, I'm in a depression. Oh my fucking god, eh? Well, 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 well. Right, when do you unlock um, 2023 and COVID-19 happens later? Um, stabilization Act for more stability? I actually need stability, man. I need stability, dude. Time delayed for Torxat A3. A satellite was delayed to the last minute malfunction. What a weird as event. I need to get rid of my depression, man. That's really bad. I still make mad money, though. China draws international condemnation for Uyghur. We see nothing wrong with it. I'm calling out China for this. 
Fuck this. Muslim Brothers, man. After all. Chan, changing your economy gives a higher risk of changing. Yeah, but I can't stay on depression, obviously, man. Right? You're playing real-life Turkish economy. Without thinking too much, complete the sentence. The problem with most of the people I've been on date with is... That I was too young for them. In my brain. Oof, deep. Deep. Okay, the Kalmar... Wait, what? The Kalmar Union has been formed. Whoa, wait, what? Wait, 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 what? Yo, there's a union formed against... The Novorussians have risen up in Ukraine. They want to be free. Actually, no, they're autocrats. And a massive union of East and North Europe has made... Whoa, that's really weird. That is very weird. Okay, I'm getting all these helicopters. That is so weird, man. Ukraine and the common union. Moldova, they're all joining. Like a preparation against Russia. That's really weird. Thank you, Admiral Wurufu. Oh, and actually, uh, a satellite has been launched. Okay. Oh, oh, and, oh, the... No. Ukraine was kicked out of the faction. What the fuck? Okay, Ukraine killed that uprising, and there's now the common union. Don't even ask, chat. Uh, yeah. Um, I was... Yeah, that was that answer. Okay, through the whole quiz. Lodge company bankrupt. Well, I have a full depression, so it doesn't hurt me that much anymore, does it? Who would you like to go back and apologize for and for what? I would like to go back to in time to my grandpa and apologize I have been such a bum. And I would like to go back to some girls I dated for, for being such a fucking childish assholeish idiot. Who would you like to go back and apologize to? I, I would like to go back to Hitler and apologize I couldn't fight for him. Yeah, you fucking weirdo. You're funny, huh? You're funny. Epic joke. What would you like to go back to your mom? <laughs> I laughed. No regrets here. Just wait 10 more years, boy. Your words, Tommy. My first girlfriend, the girls I get the, the girls I dated, yeah. Terrorist attack. The threat is rising. Getting a bit repetitive here with this terrorism. Hopefully I can fix the terrorism soon and kill it all. Be nice. Ten days I get more anti kurdish stuff. To myself in 10 years. I apologize to myself for being addicted to Tommy K. Come on. For myself for failing. Oh, My grandfather treated him like shit last time I saw him. Ay, yeah, yeah. The stream is getting way too real right now. My ex-girlfriend, we were both toxic to each other, but the experience of how not to be a dick helps me with current relationships. Yeah, that's how that's how you unfortunately grow, man. To a friend, we got into a fight over a girl and kind of killed the friendship. Shit got real. Also to my grandfather. My grandmother. Damn. Jesus. Pressure, United States is closing PKK, and I am slowly destroying the PKK. A district collapsed in Konya. Istanbul bombings happened. Jesus Christ, man, we're getting bombed a lot. Ay, 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 ay. Bunch of stability is coming in. Banner of nationalism. Six Kamalist principles are returning. Well, I'm getting the research slot after this. The six. Wait, 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 what is this? Embrace Ataturk's errors of neutral policy. You get PP, recovery rate, stability. My just my vocal time gets worse. And I get Kamalist neutrality, massive stability. I'm becoming a bit neutral here, which makes not so much sense for the military, but I get more goals later. Man, I actually really enjoy this game. I know it's very slow and boring, but I really have fun here, man. I'm really enjoying this. This is mad fun to me. Speak to my grandmother again. Let's, oh, God. You guys are getting too sad for me. What made you happy when you were a child? Well, playing with friends. Being outside with friends, man. And playing video games. Easy. Civilians killed again. Jesus. This terrorism is a problem, man. Jesus, man. In a sec, I should be... Yeah, I'm actually making the PKK weaker and weaker. Wait. People had happy childhoods. My grandfather, because I didn't care so much before the leukemia disease. It's very interesting. I want to pause the game for this. It's very interesting how when I ask you guys, what would you like to apologize for? That a lot of people in chat are saying they would like to apologize to their grandparents. Same with me. I would also like to apologize to my grandpa. Which shows something. Which I learned the hard way is the truth. 99% of us are not taking enough care of their grandparents. We don't text them enough. We don't send them letters. We don't visit them enough. I really believe in this. I, it hit me the hard way. 
because uh, I didn't take care of my grandpa enough and then he just randomly died and I could never I can never apologize for it and it sucks man and I often just say like I just told Lisa we want to make some big letters for our grandmas that just tell us about our current life of pictures and stuff and trust me man trust me I know this from the bottom of my heart if you take care of your grandparents a bit even though it's annoying you gonna you're gonna have much less regret when they die like right now you feel like ah, Oh, I'm busy, man. But when your grandparents die and they were good and they always helped you and were nice to you, you're gonna be like, bro, I could have really been for the... You know, these people did everything for us. They created our lives and our parents and they worked their ass off for for us and we can't even fucking call them once a month. That's something we all can improve, I think, most of us. Like Lisa, we gotta make these letters this week for the grandmas. Yeah, yeah. We're getting pictures out and yeah, make some letters. Yeah. <clears throat> I accidentally kissed my cousin once. Okay. Okay. What is your type? Lisa, what is my type? Lisa says I have a type. The snow white type. The snow white type. White maybe skin. Not, maybe not as pale, but like yeah. dark, long hair. Maybe a bit fuller figure. A bit curvy, a little bit thick, you mean? A little bit thickle? I'm getting the Leopard Panzer from Germany. By the way, I have this new uh, reconnaissance tank. A fixed Snow White. <laughs> what is your type, Lisa? You into redheads? Lisa always said she liked redheads. She dated redheads. It's like weird. You must be weird. No one is into redheads. Okay, very. You're very unracist in your. But being into gingers is kind of fucked up. You should check yourself. No one is into gingers. You're, you're too far ahead for the world. You're too good for this world. What the hell, man? Say black man, please. Jesus, Chet, man. I swear to God. If you look back at your childhood, what was your biggest achievement for childhood age? In the beginning of my school, I was really good at school. In the first seven years, seven, seven years, I was really good. But then I went to the that and then I don't know, you puberty hits and you're like Pfft. you know. Thank you, Southam. Thank you, man. Okay, 29 days. I should be close to fixing the PK car. Thank you, man. Uh how do you like to be comforted when you're sad? Just left alone. Easy. I, I think a lot of gamers and introverts in chat will see the same. Just be left alone. Like when when I'm very sad, just leave me alone in my room. I'm gonna have a nice Coca-Cola, play video games, dude. Just leave me alone. I don't need anyone to be like, oh, oh, oh. Like, nah. Just leave me alone. Yeah. You will have to respect it, Lisa. Um, yeah, a lot of people should say true. That's like an introvert male gamer thing, right? Or maybe just a normal introvert thing, I guess. Nothing to do with gamers. To just be left alone. The gym is the best therapy. A hawk is nice, but make it quick. <laughs> a hawk is nice. Sounds like a t-shirt, man. I'm gonna lay in bed with some Kanye West 808 and Heartbreak. That's the way. Thank you, Greek Malaka. Greek Malaka. Thank you, man. Either leave me fully alone or hugs and shit. Oh, I have a headache right here. Ow, oh, it really hurts. Oh! I think I'm not drinking enough in a day. Oh. You're so relatable today, Tommy. Oh. What, normally I'm not when I'm fully retarded? Oh. Favorite song that you play when you're sad? I listened. To, I used to listen to a lot of Limp Bizkit. Limp Bizkit and Slipknot have very, very good sad songs, man. Okay, 175, and then I kind of finished the PKK shit. Maybe. Chat is poking your brain, kinda. Complete the sentence. If someone seems to like me a lot, I tend to think that perhaps they want to fuck me. Anyway, okay, getting more upgrades here. And I got the Omtas. But they're stupid. Embrace <laughs> Atatürk. And get five stability and a research slot, man. There you go. That research is going to be so welcome. Another PKK attack. I need to really fix this PKK shit here in a second. Vermillion and stuff. Yeah, I, I, I still think the saddest song in the world is uh, Danger Keep Away from Slipknot. Love that song. China sees the C CS SCO for over from Russia, man. That's pretty big. It's pretty big. You need to go out of depression. True, fuck, I need to go out of depression. Fuck, yeah, oh shit, you're right. I totally forgot. I still make mad money, though. The money is kind of insane I'm making. 
You're totally right. I need to get out of my depression. Okay, they don't want me. I got new artillery. One sec. Let me get all the distance real quick. I want to take this game serious. I don't want to start getting lazy. I don't want to do that. Obviously, right now, it's a grindy phase. In the beginning, I'm not even done. You just have to grind, grind, grind. But after a while, man... Good shit happens. So I actually upgraded artillery to 1985. Good job. Okay, just massive military upgrades here in Turkey right now. Describe your political leanings without using the words left or right. Uh, reasonable and modern. How about you, chat? Huh? Pseudo neo ultra liberalism of the right with Trumpish investment ideas of pro Russian Slava Ukraini. Ah, that's you guys, huh? That's you guys. <whistles> Basically, AFD. Retarded, neutral. Yeah, centric, right? Makes sense. Lower your taxes for stability and construction. You're actually right, lower my tax. He's actually right about that. Lowering taxes gives you actually stability and construction? I don't, I don't even understand. Thank you, Bernie. Greece leaving EU. Ooh, that's good for us, man. But they might join the Kalmar Union. All right, I need to get rid of my uh, Al Gore won the election. Thank you, Cetus. I need to get the depression away. How much time we have left? 40 minutes. What do you think? People often don't get right in the attitudes to sex. Whoa. What do you think people often don't get right in their attitudes of sex? Oh, what a question. What do you think people don't get right in their attitudes to sex? Uh, uh, one thing that's obviously the first thing you have to say here is that some people, especially young people, think that porn is real. They think the stuff that happens in porn happens in real life, which is not the case. Uh, if anyone in chat actually has real life bunga bunga, maybe some subscribers here. Like in real life, you don't so often jerk off into 10 girls face, you know. Maybe you do as a two year sub, I don't know. But that's the first thing. Uh, Skipping, uh, don't skip foreplay. Yeah, foreplay is very, very important to get a girl going. True. What do people don't get in their attitude to sex? I think what's disgusting, and I don't want to sound like White Knight, when men only care about themselves, like they have sex with a woman, and they only care about themselves. They they don't care at all about the girl and the girl's orgasm and stuff. That's really fucking. That's not very alpha, man. What a, what an asshole. Strategic brilliance is needed next at 70. PKK is being taken care of. I, I, man, I have to do my fucking depression. I forget that all the time. Jesus. That resource lot is going to be so welcome. You're right knighting for real. Click them pussies, boys. Anyway. What do you think about... What do you enjoy about most of our relationships? Very, very easy. The best thing... Look, when you're younger, right? Relationships is like love and, and sex and whoa, 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 whoa. This cocktail of emotions. But when you get older, you realize the greatest thing about relationships is companionship. You have a... I thought my game... Fuck me. Well, I'm used to that. We're used to that, chat. I make safe games every month. Companionship. That you have someone that you go everything through. The best friend. You do everything together. You talk about everything. Companionship is... The greatest thing, man. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Jackbox today? No, I want to keep playing. Describe. What? Okay, yeah, she's making food now. Describe your first kiss. Pretty easy. I told that many times. I was out in like. It was 7th grade, 7th grade. I'm out with Christian, Victoria, and Melanie. Uh, two boys, two girls. I was in a childish relationship with Victoria, and Christian was in a weird relationship with uh, uh, Melanie. Just that childish, you know? And we were just walking around. And we went to a park house, and me and Christian were... Um, were climbing up the park house, and Victoria said, Don't do it, you're gonna hurt yourself, calm down! And I'm like, no, I'm going to climb up the park house like a fucking seven year old, right? Like, like a chat. <laughs> and she said, I will kiss you if you come down. I'm like, what? And I'm looking at Christian. Like, Dude, whoa, what? 
excuse me, what, man? And uh, uh, I come down and she gave me a kiss, man. And I remember, I was such a cringy kid, man. I was like jumping, like, whoa! Well, I was just a cringy kid. That was my first mock kiss. But I think you have to always um, dif differentiate between your first real kiss and your little... There's two kisses in life. There's the, the real kiss, if you know what I mean, boys. You know, you will find out one day if you subscribe, non sub plebs. And the, you know, and my real kiss was with Jennifer. That was also, like... No, that story I just told was actually in, like, 5th or 6th grade. And then my first real kiss was in 7th grade. I'll never forget. You never forget this. I was out with two girls, Svetlana and Jennifer. We were just running around together. That's what we did as kids. We actually went out as kids, Chad. Can you imagine that? We had no phones and stuff. And they're bringing me home. I had to go home and it was dark. And Svetlana is already leaving and me and Jennifer alone. And Jennifer says, Jennifer was far ahead, man. She was much more ahead in the brain. She said, it's time for our first kiss. And then, you know, like children do like, like, like do this. <laughs> like fucking, fucking kids, dude. <laughs> Dude, I had the first biggest boner of my life. I remember that. I, uh, dude, it was such a weird kiss, dude. Is that weird? Does anyone in chat remember the, the time when they started their first tongue kiss with girls and that they were so weird? Like, they were so fucking weird, man. Does anyone remember that? The first tongue kisses, like in school, are so weird and awkward. <laughs> I had mine with a prostitute. Damn. After we ate fries, it was terrible. <laughs> I was drunk. <laughs> but it was a great feeling, man. Dude, when old people say to be young again, man, when you're young and you have your first kiss and stuff, man, that feeling, you should cherish that feeling. You will. It slowly goes away in life. And other feelings take over, which is positive. But you need to cherish that, that stuff, man. It's really cool. Okay, I got the sector of forces. Gives me even more stability. But I get pro-Western shit. Can you go fuck yourself? The banner of populism. I actually get sifts here. The banner of populism. We're just grinding the tree, man. Grinding the tree. Okay. I need the new equipment. Investment from Russia. We're modernizing the country like crazy. Did I actually build the reconnaissance tank here in this game? I, I'm doing the reconnaissance tank. Good. Sifts are actually going up now, which is nice. I want to. I want to have this as a sift program. I think. After my first makeout, I had my hottest boner ever. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Dude, the first time making out with a girl was like, holy shit, what is happening, bro? That was a whole different level. I was all types of weird as tongue motions trying to emulate what we saw on TV. <laughs> yeah, I remember I, we, we used to emulate our first kisses on the music video from Fred Durst and Halle Berry. Behind Blue Eyes, when Fred Durst kisses Halle Berry, that's what my generation based their kissing on. I, 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 I. Thank you, Kali, for the five. Why are you giving me five subs when you talk about your first kiss? You into me, bro? Any tips for a second date? Just uh, be cool, man. Like in the first date. Just be chill and cool, bro. Be a chill, dude. When was your first blowjob? I actually don't remember. I actually don't fucking remember, dude. But it must have been insane. Do you remember your first blowjob? How long did it take for the guy to come? You see what I did there? You see what I did there? Good one, good one. Good one, good one. Good one. <laughs> Behind Blue Eyes, I got beaten up by that song. That was a big song back then. For young couples. I, 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 I. Uh, the depression is going away now? 150? So yeah, today was a very grindy Turkish stream, but the action will start soon. Let me bring some lo-fi in. The music is actually making me a little bit depressed, man. A bit of lo-fi here. Okay, recession. That depression hurts hard, man. Lo-fi radio. Let's go. Do you really think every, any one of us ever got a blowjob? Dude, don't worry, man. You get your first one, man. You will... Dude. There's like nothing better. You will find out. I'm not gonna say shit. You'll find out, bro. That shit is the worst thing ever, right? Imagine, dude, there's nothing. I'm, I'm gonna explain the worst thing in the world to you. Imagine you date a girl and it's going well. You love her, right? You wanna marry her. It's the greatest relationship ever. And then one day you're laying in bed and she says, I'm so sorry, but I'm not really into blowjobs. I, I don't think I can do that. 
Ra. Adios, man. You might be the perfect girl for me, but bye. Hey, what? <laughs> like, dude, man. That must be the worst thing to happen in a, in a world. There's nothing worse. Anyway, let's stop these uh, topics. Let's stop these topics. Lisa, you know, I'm just making comedy to entertain people for our living. I love you, Lisa. But also, as Lisa would say, let's let's talk. Let's talk about sex ed. Let's talk sex ed. As Lisa would say, and I fully agree. If you if you if you think you deserve a blowjob, you should also think that she deserves something too. If you're uh, 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 um, how to say an. Uh, if, if you are one of these old school men that like I receive oral but I'm not giving you oral that's not okay that's kind of fucked up that's not okay if they if they if they have to put that shit in their mouth man you also have to do something man you gotta it's gotta be it's gotta be a deal bro it's gotta be a deal man work a loss more PP and stuff okay very important very important. Anyway, let's stop this topic. It's weird. Uh, it's like talking to my little son about sex. What will the interior decoration be like in your ideal house? Lisa does everything. That will be my decoration. Will be probably a lot of plans. Championship and European indoor athletics has been won. Turkish Airlines, something happened. They crashed. Opinion rejected. <laughs> my wife's wiener is bigger than mine. Okay, anyway. Uh, when are you most miserable and when are you calmest in an average working day? I am most calmest in a stream in the beginning of the stream I really enjoy the first two hours because no one expects stuff from me. I can just do what I want I really enjoy that and I'm the most miserable in a stream when chat just goes full retard man. That's pretty bad Easy do we build do we build f-16s? I'm building the next jet I sent you a small video to react to it's from 9 gig about Russian logistic problems. Uh, not read the room man read the room how do you behave when you're angry? Uh, violence? I think after the sex topic, all of this is boring to you guys. The sex thing was too good. How would you describe your financial status? I actually sometimes uh, wonder that uh, if I... I'm very happy I met Lisa when I still was poor. I wonder what it's like for someone that's making a bit good money. How it is for them to, 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 to date? Like I sometimes wonder like an Asmogold or Summit or a Montana Black or um, a, a Soda Poppin. When, when they meet girls, is it... that That's so interesting, man. How that must feel like. Can you like always... Do you know they like you? Do they like the money or the fame? Like that's, that's very interesting. Oh, I got my helicopter. T129. Nice. We're actually getting somewhere, boys. T129. Helicopter. Let's go. Baby. I will need a lot of mills. <clears throat> Good. Pretty sure Summit has a wife. Does he? My guess is they're paranoid when it comes to that. Like, I think if I will, if I fan, in my fantasy think about dating again, which I hope I never will again, uh, I'm done with that, I, I will keep my job hidden for a while and my income and stuff. Like, for free dates, I will be like, ah, I have a good job. I, I survive, you know. I'm not, I'm not like poor or anything, but I wouldn't say shit, I think. Not thinking I don't want to sound sexist like you do all uh, gold diggers. It's just to, to get their real opinion about you, you know. Anyway, how strict would you be as a parent? Ah, mediocre. Yeah, these, they're getting boring now because the sex topic was too good. Describe the way you live, messy or clean. I've become very clean the last years. Lisa made that of me. First of May celebrations. USA Turkey visits. Okay. Yeah, the, the questions are boring now. The sex topic was too good. We, we, that, no one can fuck with that. See if she's a gold digger? Nah, 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 not that. I just, I just said no to that. Just to get the real opinion, you know? I want them to get a real opinion of me. That is not in any way, shape or form uh, manipulated by uh, any kind of money or something. <clears throat> Big towels soon, man. The merch is taking time, man. Tomorrow, the, the capis are coming out. Tomorrow... The high quality Vikings in Paris Cappy is coming out. I will tell you more tomorrow, man. Favorite sex position? Whatever your mom is into that night. Why do you think it would be awkward to have the talk with your son? Well, obviously, that feels awkward. I mean, obviously, dude. Come on. Sweatpants when? They are. It's all coming, man. Just stay up to date, man. It's all going to take a while. I'm massively investing in the Middle East. And a lot of technology is coming. I'm doing a lot of sips, which I have to. Because this game will go very long. I have so many focuses to do still. Restoring hope. 
United States guarantees Turkey return to life operation cases were dropped. This is kind of also a bit of a pro-Western. Oh, Korean War. I want to watch that. Expand the strike rights. Expand the worker laws. Sure, let's expand the worker laws. Why not? China War. It's a 1v1. It is 1v1, right? It's a 1v1, yeah. I have a weird feeling North Korea wins. Let's see. What year is it 2009? Well, the 2009 on the top right kind of suggests it's 2009. Okay. I might play Civ 5 tonight. Well, you're not getting late, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm just kidding, just a joke. How did Japan conclude? Well, watch the video on YouTube soon. Anyway, uh, yeah, sex and stuff, guys. What, what else do we want to talk about there? Hmm. 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 Something I always realized is that when, when you are a boy in school, let's say from let's 13 to 18, one thing I always realized, which is, is genetics, is that the girls are always ahead of the boys. When you have a, like an, an eighth grade, the girls in that class are on average always further ahead in education, of, of social matters, especially sexual stuff, a relationship. They're always ahead of the boys. You know what I mean? That's I always felt that. Like when I, the girls that I uh, these childish relationships in school, they were always far ahead of me, man. They were much further ahead than me, dude. Can I have sex with my computer? Pretty soon, probably. They had puberty early and stuff. Yeah, they they grow faster in that time. Whose mom? Whose mom is your favorite to spend time with? Uh, uh, Red Belize. Imagine having a son and found out it's a furry. Yeah. Most awkward moments during sex. Uh, let's not go there, bro. I don't want to go too deep. Dog or cat? Uh, cat. Flashlight? Any good? I never used a flashlight. Don't know if that's good. Flashlight seems kind of sad. That's why. I will, I will, if I will use a flashlight, I will feel kind of sad. I will be like, whoa, man. Whoa. That was kind of sad, Tommy, what you did there. Industrial lease. Did you ever have to talk with your parents? No, no. My parents would never. I had to do everything myself. My parents would never talk to me about stuff like this. It really does seem sad. It's just a joke off. I don't know. Everybody has to decide, you know. I don't know. I don't know. Imagine cleaning that shit. That would make me cry. <laughs> Korea, very, very stealthy here, huh? A lot of cool equipment is coming. I'm slowly building up Turkey. Gonna take another year, some years until I'm ready. The CHP is about to take me over soon, man. Jesus. Post not depression. Especially with post not clarity. Cleaning a flashlight sucks. Investment from China. I just got new equipment again. We're getting pretty, pretty strong here now. I just got new IFVs. Expand the strike rights. Korea just got war in Japan. Okay. Unions under the power of the state. You lose stability, get it back, but you get minus five consumer goods. That seems insane. Is there a world war now? No, it's just Korea and Japan versus North Korea. Is China going to join us? I wonder. You remember your first fab? I remember my first fab completely. I remember everything. I remember it so well. I could even draw the room and everything. I remember it completely. Man, it was I don't remember too much about that weird time when 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 you were a boy and you start experiencing your penis. When you start realizing this sounds weird, right? When you start realizing, hey, you can do stuff with your ding dong, right? That's a weird time in a boy's life. It's a fucking weird time, dude. It's exciting and weird. Very, very weird, man. Right? And I remember it started, you know, you start realizing you can have a boner and shit. And and I remember it completely. It was during the day, the sun was out, and my parents were gone. And I was... Fuck, man. And before this game is gonna die now. I'm gonna not give up. I'm still having my monthly saves. And before this is gonna fall apart now. Um, I was playing GTA Vice City. I remember it completely. I was playing GTA Vice City. And I will never forget, never forget. I am um, AFK getting a drink or something and suddenly a woman is talking to me. She's like, hey, honey, you want to have a good time? Like, what the fuck's happening? What? I'm just AFK in my car and this girl goes into my car and she says, let's go to a, a, a quiet place. Like, what the fuck is happening? What's going on? So I'm driving into a corner and 
the 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 car starts shaking. There's no animations, right? Both characters sit in the car like this. This is an old game, Vice City, a very old game. It's just like they're sitting there, and the car is honking, and she starts moaning, and I'm like. And it fucking happened. And I was like, what the fuck was that? My first step was to GTA Vice City. True story, bro. True story, man. If this game crosses too much now, we actually have a problem, guys. That would be very sad. I really enjoy this content. That would be really, really sad, to be honest. That would be a big problem. Thank you, Mario. Uh, I have a message to all the people that laugh at me right now. You guys are younger. When I was young, there was no porn. There was no. There was nothing. There was nothing to jerk off to. You, you guys don't understand. Buy Bitcoin. Yo. I can buy Bitcoin, chat. There was nothing to jerk off to. We had to use fantasy and stuff. You guys don't understand that. You guys have your phone nowadays. We didn't have stuff like this, dude. You have no idea how it felt like back then. Okay, more equipment. Which. What? Huh? I hear the, the soldier equipment. My first rap was on a sexual gif on an internet site I was watching for school. <laughs> I hope you weren't in school though. That would be weird. <clears throat> How old were you though? I don't remember, man. I don't fucking know. I'm actually so old, I dropped off to sales magazines with fucking brown swimsuits. Me too. My mom had auto catalog. Auto catalog, I would always, it was this thick, I would open the section with the with the girls in bikinis and then banga langa, man. Back then, that was the world, man. These kids nowadays have no idea. Let's get stagnation back. You guys have no clue. Did the same as San Andreas, you could take pictures with the camera and I always took pictures of my ass and titties. Of asses and titties. You were a fucking stalker in the San Andreas, bro? I found the magazine of that from my father two years ago. Dude, I remember my 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 family, my parents were hiding one Playboy. And they were hiding that for historical reasons. True, because in Eastern Germany there was a big star called Katharina Witt. Katharina Witt, she was an ice skating uh thing. Katharina Witt. And it was a very big scandal back then that she was in the Playboy. And uh, she's a bit older now, obviously. And uh, she had a, a, a Playboy um, uh, 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 issue. She was much younger then, and I will joke off to that for forever, man. Because I had nothing else. I had nothing else, bro. I had nothing else. It just was the world, man. You guys are so privileged today. <laughs> Thank you. I jerked off the first time to GTA 5 lap dance. How many fucking boys jerked off for the first time in GTA, man? It's kind of crazy. Thank you, Jack Kista. Jack Kista. That was a historic jerk off. Is it really true that porn gives a bad view on sex? Uh, yes. Yes. It's true. And North Korea is done, baby. North Korea has been finished. There you go. Ruben. True. Not gonna say it out loud, but totally true. Oh, Marconi is such a normie. I'm not even gonna say what he just said. I'm not gonna go into that, but you such you just exposed yourself as the biggest normie, dude. Oh my god. Is GTA 5 the first GTA where you can actually see boobs? I remember I once dropped off to Mass Effect 2 in the Citadel, where one of these alien bitches did a striptease for you. Yes, <laughs> yes, and I have no regrets. <laughs> it was different times. It was different times, dude. <laughs> A lot of kids doing that in Fortnite now. Yeah, that's why they all look at Minecraft porn and that weird shit, dude. I'm telling you. One guy in chat actually dropped off to Minecraft porn once and he's like, oh, Tommy, is that weird, Tommy? Is that weird, Tommy? When I found my dad's magazines, a whole new world opened up to me. Dude, you're just... Stating yourself sex life to 3k viewers. Who cares, man? We're all gonna die in the next hundred years. Don't take it too serious. We have way too much in common in that topic. <laughs> Thank you, Slatan. Greetings from Ankara, best city ever. Ankara. Ankara. Okay, I need the seven stability back. And my economy is going pretty nice now. Who was the best romance for Mass Effect, though? I don't remember too much. I was into Tali Zora. I liked her. And I killed her in the end. That was such a shock for me. That was the biggest shock. I sent Tali into the uh, air conditioning system in the last mission, and she fucking died. I killed my girlfriend in Mass Effect 2. I will never recover from it. Never forget it. 
same that was so crazy dude you have to actually set the cyborg guy into the uh airman system i that was so sad dude thank you hash brown brother thank you man have positive evil will all die next 50 years ah, shut up. wait oh it's starting wait this is actually getting interesting oh it's getting interesting the Nakshian agreement was signed in 2009 it's agreement signed by azerbaijan kazakhstan kisastan and turkey which are participating states at the summit of the heads of the turkish speaking countries and is a prerequisite for the establishment of the turkic union the main mission of the agreement is to in the institutionalization of cooperation between these turkish states here we go the turkish union starts That actually happened in real life. <sighs> Turkish Union starts, man. That's gotta be interesting. I, I just hope the game doesn't crash so much anymore. The game is actually crashing a shit ton, man. Which is a problem. I have to pee, man. But the stream is almost over. <clears throat> Getting new equipment on the daily. Equipment, equipment, equipment. We're actually soon reaching a point where I'm uh, up, 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 up state with the um, technology of the world. Will you play CK Free Game of Thrones when it gets out? Uh, yes. I have to pee. Ugh. So yeah, today we just grinded a bit, but I enjoyed that. The only fear I have that the game crashes too much and I can't play this anymore. This is mad fun to me, to be honest. And I can't wait to take the game more serious soon. Uh, I should probably take the army um, logistics guy next. How often did you used to drop off when you were young? I don't remember. I don't remember, but when you are a fucking young boy in the puberty, you jerk off as much as you can. If my parents were gone, the first swine flu case. Oh. The mod really improved compared to what it used to be. Yeah, but a bit unstable. When will you make the list of 16 hour stream or is it done already? Uh, didn't do that yet. No, I, I have to talk to Lisa still about 16 hour stream. We have to organize that. Be patient. <clears throat> I do it while my parents are home. Dude, you want to hear one universal truth of life? Before we end today's stream, I'm going to tell you something that is just the truth. No matter what you think. Your mom knows you jerk off. You think you're alone in your room. You think she's sleeping. You think nobody knows. She fucking knows. She just respects you and doesn't want to make it awkward. So she's not coming in. She is not telling you. She fucking knows, brother. Oh, she knows. And she's a good lady. That's why she's not talking shit about it. I know it sucks, chat. I know it's hard to hear. She actually told me? Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's so weird. Ugh. They know. They know. Bangladesh joins SCO. I want more army XP, man. Fuck you, I have my PC speakers on and she just heard that. <laughs> well, the truth is the truth. Do you have any plans for Skyrim again? What? We just wasted 7k points on that shit. Okay, getting high command. Doing the tax act. Which really sucks. I don't like. First you give me consumer goods and then you take them away again. I don't understand this. Unsevaton denounced you. Then you kill the neutrality. I just have to do all these focuses. We're just grinding, 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 boys. Kids that uh, were got jerking off grow into voyeurs. Changed my mind. Ooh, that's deep. That's deep. Just jerk off in the shower to evade any possibilities of getting caught. Kurdish party has been closed. The Kurdish party has been closed. Tickle worker activity. I lose stability. A lot of events happening. Showers OP. Hmm. Thoughts on TNO playthrough. What, what are your thoughts on getting cancer? <clears throat> Do you pee in the shower? Never. In my entire life, I didn't pee in the shower once. I swear. I think that's disgusting. Peeing in the shower. I That is ridiculous to me. That's insane to me. Never once. Never once. I'm a guy, man. Even when I was 14 years old, I will literally leave the swimming pool in the public bath and go to the toilet. I will never pee in the water. Bro, I, that, no, and how the fuck can you pee in the shower, man? I, no. No. That is weirding me out. I kind of get why you do it. It's not 
that weird, I get it, but there's no way now. No, no way. Thank you, Camel Man. Poo in the shower? Yeah, I poo in the shower, sure. I remember a story, man. I was like a kid, like really young, and I pooped in the bathtub. I'll never forget. <laughs> I'll never forget that. Istanbul becomes one of the European capitals of the culture in 2010. I, I, I remember this. There's just things you, you just remember. I was like a kid, like really young, like really young. And my mom is bathing me. Like I'm in the bathtub, and she's bathing me. And all of a sudden, pieces of poop go on the surface. And my mom was like, what the fuck, man? And I was like, dude, I don't know. What, I don't know what happened here. I just po I just pooped. <laughs> I just pooped right there. And it was swimming everywhere. <laughs> dude, being a mom is hard, man. We all need to respect our moms. I mean, who didn't poop his pants or pee his pants? At, one, at least once, man. And then the parents have to take care of that shit. Oh, I used to have this guy in my school, Tony, not my Tony, who would always pee his pants, like, even until fifth grade, man. I feel bad for that guy. Uh, there's just things you never, ever forget. Never, ever forget. We were playing catch in the schoolyard. I'll never forget. We were playing catch in the schoolyard, and Tony is hunting us. Not, not my Tony, a different Tony. And I will never forget, he couldn't get me, and he stopped running. And I'm, I'm turning around, I look at him, what's up, Tony? And I will never forget, he said, oh, fuck, not again! And he will pee his pants, I'll never forget that. Poor guy, thank you, Paragon. Like, even, like, school teachers and stuff, right? In the first four grades, they have to handle kids that pee themselves a lot. If you were a teacher in one to fourth grade, you probably have to look at vomit, pee, and poop sometimes, yeah. He said not again, that poor guy, man. He's he's a big chemical engineer today. <clears throat> Little Tony. Yes, we have to. This guy had some trauma from that. <laughs> he's into golden showers nowadays. <laughs> God, poor guy. Okay, I have full investments. Cool. Now he's choosing his piss for chemical weapons. Okay, you idiot. There's just stuff you never forget. Stuff you never forget. I remember there was this kid, Pat, Pat Patrick. He was this, you know, you know this kid, you know when you have a school class in school, like we're talking about first to seventh grade, you're still young, right? No point period yet, thank you, Seeker. And there's always this one boy who's way too big for his class, because he's like a bit dumb and he, he skips classes. There's this one boy who's just way too big for everyone else. Does it make sense to you? There's always that one guy who's too big. In my in my school, it was Patrick. Patrick, not Patrick, Patrick. The, the fucking German bullshit. And what Patrick will do, that piece of shit motherfucker, man. That complete cunt. Look, back then, we had the high time of Pokemon cards. And everybody will bring their cards to school. Like, hi, guys. You want to see my Pokemon cards? Look right here. It was a big thing back then, right? And Patrick was much bigger and stronger than everyone else. So what Patrick will do, I'll never forget. He will sit on the park bench in the in the school break. It was it was a fifth grade, fifth grade, fourth grade. And what what he will do is it's like this. Can I look at your cards? Oh, can I please have your card for a second? Oh, oh thank you. Is it okay for you if I put the card into my uh, into my book real quick? I just want to see what it looks like. Yeah, okay. You're not gonna say no because he's so big. So he will put it in and be like. And you're like, hey Patrick, can I get my card back? What fucking cop? What are you talking about, you bitch? <laughs> he would just fucking keep it. That piece of shit. I hope he's on Hawks Fear nowadays, that cunt. He was a bit troubled, I think, in the brain. He was just fucking... Pfft. What you gonna do, bitch? What you gonna do? That guy was troubled, though. If I if I think back at it now, he was actually troubled, man. That guy had some mental issues. Dude, I, I have so many remembrances now. I remember he would always get mad and scream at the teachers like... He would literally do that to teachers, to adults. He was obviously a bit troubled, man. I remember that. He would be like, Arr! in front of teachers. People like this exist, man. I was in a weird school. Weird school. Same in my school, but they were suspended. Yeah, they, there's probably special schools for that. Okay, I need to get my stable growth back. <sighs> Fifth grade guy that already knew about sex chased me and my best friend and tried to educate us and we didn't want to hear it. Weird. Not a massive earthquake. Oh no. Oh no. He needs to go to school for bad children. Yep. 
to be back in fourth grade, man. That shit was so funny. Dude, your biggest issue was Pokemon. You go to school, you're kind of intelligent, and the, the school is very easy. And it's break, and you and your friends, let's play Pokemon. Nobody knew how to play Pokemon. Nobody understood. It's just like, up the catch you go, man. And you go home, and you just go out with your friends, having fun. And then in the evening, mom makes you food, and you play video games. It was the greatest time, dude. Yet no issues, bro. No women, no builds, no fucking Ukraine war. You just fucking Yu-Gi-Oh, man. Let's go. The most innocent time of your life, dude. So if there's any kids watching, Marconi, um, preserve that time, man. You're gonna miss it, man. You're gonna miss it. That was the good times, man. Nowadays you're just depressed about everything. The world sucks. I need to pee really bad. I have to call it here. Let's go stable growth and then I call it. When I do stable growth, I call it. Ignorance is bliss, yes. The same, I got molested a lot though. Okay, man. Dude, we were such fucking asocial children. I just have so many remembrances now. Outside the school, they will asphalt a road. With, uh, they will make a way with, uh, with concrete. Fresh concrete. It does, I wanna speak in English here. They would make a fresh concrete road. And me and the boys, we fucking little trolls, like a Twitch chat, we will always be like... And we waited for the construction workers to leave. All day long, these fucking construction workers were building the concrete floor. And they made the shield. Don't touch, it's still wet. The moment they left, me and the boys... I'm drawing a penis! Aha! Uh -huh. Pikachu! And the next day, the whole walk was completely destroyed, man. Completely destroyed. Can't you maybe see that nowadays? One sec. Nah, they, they totally fixed that nowadays, right? And we were, we, were, we were the most fucked up kids, man. We were Azi Kinder, as you say in Germany. We will be a menace to society as kids. We will do so much bad shit, man. Where's my old school? Denmark needs you. Is that path still fucked? But this is where I grew up. And I was growing up here, and my old school is... Uh, this is my school. Uh, they, they actually looked different back then. And this is where the 1 to 4th grade... This is how in East Germany it works. This is 1 to 4th grade, and this is uh, 5 to 10 grades. This is the adults, and this is the kids. And we'll always play here. And ah, you can't see it, okay. And right here, there's a pathway we just fucked up. Oh, but yeah, this is all, dude, this used to be all communist blocks, they're all gone now. And like right here, you see this path, this path. We will always steal um, invisible uh, tape, invisible tape from the store. And then between these bushes, we will make a spider net of tape. And adults, we would always then be in the, we will be in the bush like little trolls. <laughs> And then, like, an adult woman, a woman coming home from work, will just walk into our spider net of fucking tape and like, Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> we, were, we were a menace to society, bro. <laughs> fucking trash people. Dude, I feel so bad. We had a teacher, an ethics teacher, who would live right next to school. And that came out. People started realizing she lives next to school. And she will get terrorized, man. People will do the, the ring uh, prank. We will ring the bell and run away every day. That woman had to literally move. Because I, I mean, after all, I was in a school and in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in an area where we only have idiot kids. Like, uneducated Azikino. Like, these kids didn't have educated parents, man. It was just complete war and looking back at it now i feel bad for these teachers man the fucking shit they had to go through for a shitty salary the fucking bullshit I, it's all coming back now i had so many trouble kids in my school I, I, I there was this kid called jens i can't say his last name but he had the weirdest last name jens and he was one of these troubled kids he would always punch teachers he would just like Alter, mach mich nicht an. Ich kann's he was like fifth grade and he was already two meters tall that fucking weird ass ogre man that orc ass urukai he would punch teachers that was my school dude it was no normal dude I remember in history class, he would uh, hit uh, Mrs. Kutula. Her name was Kutula. I always made the joke from the Godzilla movie. What's her name? Kutula, Kutula. I remember that. It's all coming back now. Populist principles. Uh, okay, I want to do my economy and then I have to actually call it. I need to pee bad. What's happening in Germany? What? Every country has that. Like schools where troubled kids are from uneducated families where everybody is fucking crazy stabbing each other. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
CHP resigns. Listen to his speech. Hukuksuz ve ahlaksız komploları hazırlayanların ve onların komplolarına itibar edenlerin, dürüst ve onurlu insanların manevi cesetlerini çiğneyerek nereye kadar gidebileceklerini hep beraber göreceğiz. Bunun nasıl bir Türkiye oluşturmakta olduğunu er geç anlayacağız. Kendinden menkul bir ahlak zabıtalığını bizzat verifte edenlerin insanlık tarihi boyunca Hz. Peygamber'den başlayarak günümüze kadar ne mağduriyetlere yol açtıklarını çok iyi biliyoruz. Bu tablo karşısında bana da bir görev düştüğünün farkındayım. Bu kara kampanyaya teslim olmayacak. Bu hukuksuz ve ahlaksız komplo nedeniyle kimsenin beni sorgulamasına izin vermeyeceğim. Eğer bunun bir bedeli varsa ve bu bedel Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi Genel Başkanlığı'ndan ayrılmaksa o bedeli de ödemeye hazırım. Benim Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi Genel Başkanlığı'ndan istifa etmem hiçbir şekilde bu komploya teslim olmak ya da kaçmak anlamına gelmez. Tam tersine bu bir meydan okumadır. Bu anlayışla bugün Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi Genel Başkanlığı'ndan istifa ediyorum. Bu komplonun hedefi Sadece ben değilim. Aynı zamanda Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi'dir. Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi de bu kirli tezgahlar karşısında yolunu seçmek zorundadır. Benim istifa kararım hem Türkiye siyasetini ve Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi'ni yeniden tanzim etmek isteyenlere bir imkan tanıyacak hem de Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi'ne bu komployla hesaplaşma fırsatı verecektir. Yalansız, dürüst, cesur bir duruş sergilemek sadece benim işim olmamalıdır. Deniz Baykal'ın ve Cumhuriyet Halk Partisi'nin ötesinde bütün Türkiye olarak hepimiz Şile'ye ve Şer'e dayalı bir kalleşlik politikasına dur demek zorundayız. Umarım bütün bu Yaşananlar ve benim istifam Türkiye'de. See you tomorrow, chat. See you tomorrow, dude. That's actually really good content. We just had an event that the Turkish nations involved in Kazakhstan made the Turkish Union, which is now Kazakhstan dying to house Romanov, house Romanov, while even Israel is talking shit about us. We have really good content here. Why did the chat just get deleted? There it is. Zero man. Um, that's that's really good, man. We actually have stuff to do now. Russia is our main enemy. We have to save. We have we have our goal. Like I always say, the, you always say, Toby, what's your goal in this campaign? The goal is that the goal comes from the campaign, and it looks like we have to liberate the. He had sex tapes. That's why he resigned. Well, with that voice, he sounds very sexy. Gentlemen, thank you for watching. That was Elden Ring and the Turkey stream part two. Very exciting. I really love this content, man. Tomorrow, more Elden Ring, and we're gonna keep playing Turkey. I'm not gonna play anything else. I'm gonna announce six hour stream soon and what games we play there, man. Thank you for watching. Have a great evening, man. That's my outro song. I love you guys. It was a pretty good stream, man. It was really fun. And yeah, have a great evening. And tell your grandparents you love them. Bye, 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 bye.